yellow hi guys creep keeper thank you so much for the seven months welcome back thank ya just when we discussed wishing a non-mother happy mother's day well it depends some people are moms in some ways um which is why i'm wearing a taylor swift shirt because she's she's in some ways a lot of people's moms too you know oh stream mom yeah i'm a cat mom i'm somi's mom hey somi what'd you give me for mother's day huh hey hey somi hey somi didn't give me anything for mother's day damn no i bet other cats out there gave their moms Okay, well, the real question is, did you guys tell your moms Happy Mother's Day yet? Hmm? Because I didn't. I am going to call her at the... Uh, after this, and I will tell her um, Happy Mother's Day and everything. Um, we have the same name. Hi! Hell yeah, all the Yvonne's unite. Let me give you a happy life as a cat mom, right? Mm. Yeah, yeah. She gave me like what I feel like I would have if I was a, an actual mother. She also <clears throat> kind of gave me like uh, also another feeling of how, how it'd be like to have a dog because she wants to play all the time. She has so much energy. She is, you know, like. I don't know, just a bunch of stuff. <laughs> My brother and I went to her home today and gave her flowers and new shoes. That's so nice. So she's a cat dog. She is a cat dog. Uh, bro, Brita Somi, she is a. Seal links by color ragdoll. Yep. <gasps> it's Somi's birthday soon. Uh. Um. Somi, I totally remember that it was your birthday coming up. <laughs> How many parties have you guys been to post week? Dude, there's been so many birthdays and also, uh, like, events because of API month. So, it's there's been Gold House events and stuff. So, we went to this premiere called Exo Kitty. Um, if I talked to you guys about it, but basically, it was a really... Uh, I personally love the show and I can't wait for it to come out because I already liked the first episode. It... Like, I think I told you guys, it's like, a, um, for when I kind of debriefed it a little bit, um, it's very to all the boys I've loved before, but I would arguably say in terms of the jokes and all this kind of stuff might even be better now because, um, although there are some cheesy parts still, like the jokes were funnier, I felt. I am. Um, yeah so it's called exo kitty and a, a, the cast were great um i remember telling you guys about like the brother and sister one <laughs> how they're like how two of the main cast members are brothers and sisters um but we, i went to another event yesterday my friend chelsea invited me to this uh thing she started hosting called club her um it's a place for girls in the industry to kind of get connected and uh she asked me if i could do a panel so then i did a little bit of panel i think she put together autobi like uh kind of like biographies for everyone and then i always feel very <laughs> when someone's like this is yvonne she's done like this 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 she's part of whatever i'm like why do i feel so um like that is not me uh, in terms of that it's it just does not I, it doesn't really connect lawrence thank you so much for the 58 months welcome back thank you lawrence a whopping 58 um my brother's girlfriend told me they're having a baby today our mother's day gift wait that is that is such a good mother's day gift what the heck wait unless you're well no 
it's a happy thing for everyone. I was gonna say unless they did, unless your um mom, that's not what your mom would want for Mother's Day. But why wouldn't you? I think unless you're like, I don't want to be a grandmother. Congrats! Everyone's happy. What do you mean you didn't do it? Um, it's kind of like when people are like, oh, you're like a really global streamer, like all these kind of things. It's just like, I don't really, uh, <laughs> sounds funny. I don't know. Just don't feel like I live up to like the, the description of it all. Not necessarily like, you know, it's just, it's just a lot. But it was nice. She was she she meant it in like a positive way to like hype you up. Like oh like you're like a part of this uh, offline TV like blah blah all this kind of stuff. Like yes. Yush. I got her a mixer baking thing she wanted and flowers, dude. I love KitchenAid mixers. It's one of the best gifts. I called her and sent her a card. I will text my mom and call her. Oh, God. Did I call her? No, I can't call her now. Um, I'll call her at some point. <sighs> well. No, I would call her now, but I feel like. Um, you guys are just gonna hear me speak Cantonese to her, and then most of you guys are not gonna be able to understand it anyway. And she might just be like very... Watch what she says. <laughs> um... It could because... The reason why I think it could... Well, the thing is, my mom used to be on my stream all the time. Back then when I streamed back home, she would like come in and give me fruits, and then she'd just end up on camera. And then, uh... I remember I was vlogging. The last, last time I went back to Canada, I was vlogging, and uh... Or I was talking to my mom, and she was like, saying all these things, like... Um... And then... And then I pull up my camera, and I start vlogging, because I'm like, okay, she's yelling at me, I'm gonna vlog this. And then she instantly stops. My mom just keeps saying your thing. What, what were you saying before? And she's just like, doesn't say anything. Like, <laughs> yo, yo. Just don't want other people to know how you talk to me. But yeah. Um. I'm trying to think, like, if there's a fond memory I have with my mom and I can only really remember recent times I remember when I was very little she was bad cop so there wasn't a lot there <laughs> except for um there was like a picture of us building like a snow a little snowman together um I would say mine and my mom's relationship did not get good until probably after I left uh to to uh California so I'm trying to think. She... Uh, well, one of the nicer memories that I can remember recently is when I went back and I was like, Mom, like, what do you want for, like, anything? I just want to, like, get you something. I haven't, it's my first, it was my first time back in Canada in, like, two years-ish because of COVID. And so I was asking her, like, oh, do you want something from the mall? Like, let's go to the mall. Like, I'll get you something. And... Uh, I took her to, we were walking around like LV and then she didn't really see anything she liked and then we went and passed, yeah, you remember, I remember telling you guys and then like, uh, I saw Dyson and I was like, oh, do you want something from Dyson? And she's like, oh, like vacuum? Like, yeah, 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 let's go there. And she was so excited. She did not give a shit about any luxury brands. She just wanted a fucking vacuum, okay? So we go in and then they didn't have the vacuum. Like, I wanted to get her the one that was like the V, like, is it? 11 or something like something that had higher um a stronger power so that she wouldn't have to like you know uh like like vacuum so many times yeah i did tell the story in my vlog i think um and then and then because they didn't have it i asked her what else she would have wanted and she straight up was like you know how about you just give me like give me usd like give me cash you know what i mean and i'm like so you could 
like for stocks or what she's like yeah because she like she's retired she um, sits at home now every day playing um chinese dramas and uh she but she wakes up very early at six because that's when stocks uh, open or something like that so she'll wake up and then she'll just and the thing is she's not even like a huge gambler she's the one who did not let me gamble as a kid at all i was not allowed to touch anything gambling or mahjong she never taught me mahjong because she did not want me to um gamble right so even when she wants money for stocks she doesn't it's not like penny stocks it's not like crazy stocks she literally just puts in like the safest stocks anyways and just checks them every day so i don't know um i don't <laughs> your mom's the same way yeah there's just low risk and like she but she just wants the the usd to do it she's like yeah usd's kind of high right now like just if you if you <laughs> give me anything just give me cash <laughs> it kind of feels like growing up as a as you get older you're just like uh mom dad don't really give me gifts anymore you can just give me cash like Have you been cooking anything new? Oh, yes. Hey, I found a uh, chicken pho recipe on TikTok. And so I tried making that. Um, some a little adjustments on like the seasoning with like uh, stock because you need use different seasonings. I'm not that, or I use different seasonings. That I'm not really particularly used to like star anise or other things. So the star anise was a bit strong, but when I took out the star anise and then put it in the fridge and then heated it up again, the broth actually tasted a lot better and it was fine. So maybe it was just the star anise that was like in it, it. If you leave it in the broth, then it makes it a little strong for that. Yeah. Well, now I know if you ever cook with star anise, you don't need to use that much of it. You could just use a little bit, but it's always about adjustments, right? So, um, yeah. Breakfast stream? Oh my god. I would love to do that. I'll make the egg rolls and like little other breakfast things. Oh my god, that could be so cute. It would just be themed. It'll be lunch. A breakfast, lunch, and dinner. Um I'd, yeah, I would freaking love to do that. What did the house look like for Pokey's birthday? It looked beautiful. Oh my god. It was like it was such a nice house. You had to drive up this windy hill. And, um, let me tell you, the view, when I looked out, it was foggy at the top, and then bottom was all, like, trees and nature, and then you would see very big houses, like, here and there. It felt like we were in, like, a forest area because of the fog and everything with all the trees, except for there was civilization. So you would see, like, um, houses here and there, but it was, it was beautiful, and the party was just insane she had so she had like chipotle catering and then she had a boba bar type of thing so there is um you can get boba and you can get egg waffle and um obviously there's a photo booth uh there was oh sprinkles cupcakes and like beer pong me and Michael played against Jody and Peter and Beer Pong. We completely schooled the fuck out of them. Was not even close. Was not down to one ball for each team type of close. Just know we were owning and then they somehow got like a bounce and a whatever man you know what? it don't matter they caught up basically and then we were down to like one one go but we won then that's all that matters <clears throat> resident party animal listen okay listen it's all so that i could win at these games all right i party so that i could win at party games <laughs> you know I am quite proud of my beer pong progression. I remember when I first played it, I was fucking dog diggity dog shit. And then now, now I can kind of, I'm okay, you know? I'm not like God tier, but I'm like, there's like beginner and then there's medium and then there's uh, expert, <laughs> advanced. I may be like medium or beginner medium, like somewhere around there, you know? 
sometimes I still forget the rules. So, um, I forget like how many cups sometimes you take away when, when you, okay. When you throw one and then the second one, um, your partner throws it in and it's in the same cup. How many cups do you take away? Two or three? Three. Three. Right? Because I feel like if you take away two, that's the same as just getting two in. I think it's got to be three. It's a bonus. It's got, yeah, it's got to be three. That's just logically like you make two cups in. Um, and then if it's a bounce, then do you take away two for that one bounce? Like you bounce it in, then they get two cups. You know what I mean? Yeah. Um, and then if you make three in a row then you're on fire and you can wait see sometimes i don't see this is the that's the part i don't remember like all the rules two equals heat three equals fire what does heat mean versus fire like heat is like oh you're about to be fire <laughs> there's house rules yeah there's house rules but i'm just saying in general oh okay Um, th two same cup is three and balls back. Oh yeah. If you both make it in, you get the balls back. Um, fire just means you can keep going until you miss. Okay. I remember all these men. Is. Beer pong is really hard when table is eye level? What? Bitch? How dare? How dare? What are you saying about Michael? That's fucked up. Huh? That is absolutely... That's absolutely... Rude and disgusting of you to say. I will not stand for this Michael slander. XT17, thank you so much for the prime. <clears throat> yeah. What if they were talking about themselves? Oh. Well, were you talking about yourself? Mm -hmm. Is the beer pong table eye level to you? Um, advice for my wife and soon to be? Oh, yeah. I actually do. I saw this on TikTok yesterday and I agree or the other day and I agreed. Him. <clears throat> Advice for wife to be or for your for your for your marriage. Yes, it's a Taylor Swift t-shirt because Mother's Day. Um all right. So basically, uh a lot of people feel like relationships should be 50-50, right? Like, oh, you put in this much, you should be in that. Which on Overall, like you want to feel like your partner is putting in a good amount or equal effort to you, right? But the thing with marriage, especially to a relationship that is very long lasting, there will be times where certain people take the front seat and then there's some people who take the back seat. Um, one of my friends, their parents have done this in terms of work. So there was a time where uh, the husband was more focused on his career things were taking off and then she was kind of taking more of the backseat like um taking more time off from work like staying home with the kids or helping more around the house like doing more of the house thing so he could focus more on work and then there's a certain point where that switched where sh uh she started working or she uh got promotion at work she started doing whatever and like she her career was taking off and then because he was like steady or everything was uh he was like fine so he kind of like tried to help her out more and took he took the back seat while she took the front seat and she started like going off and trying to like thrive work wise right uh my others thank you so much for the prime thank you thank you but yeah this is actually something yeah my friends literally have their parents that have this like type of relationship that they were talking about how like they um just would switch and i think this also happens emotionally where um sometimes what your partner may be going through a more difficult time and you need to be there you need to be the one who's putting in 80 percent, and they're maybe putting in 20 percent. but that's because like that's their max capacity at the time and their bandwidth at the time so 
and it won't always be like that sometimes maybe like you're gonna be the one who's going through the hard time and then it will swap and so it's kind of like understanding and being okay with it not being even like not kind of calculating that and all you know so all the time and so i think that would like um yeah random thing i saw from tiktok so but also like a real life i've always known it but i was reminded again when i saw that tiktok yeah it's just not ever gonna be like equal equal or don't expect it to be equal sometimes you're gonna be the one who wants to do nice things for them sometimes they're gonna be the one to do nice things for you yeah <clears throat> or just listen to everything your wife has to say because happy wife happy life you know what do people usually do at big parties and hey hang on with friends or just talk to people they don't really meet um like so yesterday it was i i mainly had fun just seeing and talking to everyone um there are some people that i haven't seen there in a really long time so i got to catch up with some people um met maybe like a couple people and then as soon as i like didn't really know what to do i kind of looked around and i was like you know what there's a beer pong table like i want to play beer pong i like i like doing activities um if i'm not engaged in a conversation with someone because i kind of don't like as much kind of sitting around just like you know um uh i like to find things to do so uh i like beer pong because it's like a sport or activity so yeah um i'm, I'm so we're just doing that and then um what did i do i had this tort i had this tortilla okay hmm all right basically uh, Iman had Chipotle catering, right? So I um, want to get some Chipotle. I go over to the catering table, okay? And I'm like, I want tortilla because like sometimes if you go to Chipotle, they can you can get tortilla on the side and it's really good. And I just wanted one on the side. So I see this like tortilla peeking out, like the stack of tortillas. Um, and it's like covered with like aluminum foil. So you can't see the full thing. But anyway, as I'm pulling it out, I'm pulling it, I'm pulling it it's a giant piece of tortilla okay it's not even like a like like a like the one this or one this it was like this and so i pull it out i'm like holy fuck this is way too much and i already touched it i touched it so i can't just put it back and so i grab my my bowl and i put it in my bowl and i'm like okay well this is a and then and then i see the rest of the stuff like the rice the chicken the whatever the fuck and i'm just thinking like there's no way i could eat all of this especially with this giant ass tortilla so then i think you know what scrap all the other stuff i'll just eat the tortilla i'll just get rid of this so i'm just walking around the party um ripping this giant tortilla that's in my bowl and everyone that i talk to is like literally judging me very fast they instantly spot it and they're just like Hey, what's up with the tortilla and i'm like hey like listen i can explain um and so i i'm i explained to them that like you know i accidentally pulled out a giant piece of tortilla and that it was too it ended up being too much and then so now i'm just eating this piece of, I don't, and i would offer it to everyone but, hey you can want some tortilla like it's pretty good uh if you heat it up it would be better but like it's, so it's kind of cold right now but like you know it's it's good jody just looked at me hello jo like like um young yeah like uh-huh yeah uh well stella was actually normal about it everyone else i would say not peter lily tortilla ended up being the icebreaker conversation starter but the problem was it was with people i already knew like i did not need it as a conversation starter i just got judged tj saw too tj was just like what's up with the tortilla and i was like I would explain, but I, I'm just I'm just gonna go back. And then later, later I see TJ with just the tortilla. Dude, no, the tortilla is delicious. It's especially good when it's when it's when it's warm. Like when you heat it up, it's like, oh, that's that's so fucking good. When they put normally at Chipotle when they have like the giant thing and they like clap it down and then they 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 warm the tortilla mm, and then they wrap it in the aluminum foil and it's toasty yeah that just slaps 
Oh yeah, the flat press. Mmm, it's so good. Side tortillas used to be free, now they're 50 cents. Wait, they're 50 cents now? I thought they were still free. That kind of makes me want a flat press now. Uh, am I playing game this stream? I don't know. Uh, I'm gonna be streaming roughly until like 4.30 or 5. So that's about like two and a half to three hours from now. Solo tortilla is a good snack. Though it is. It's so good. Imagine XQC starts asking questions about that to you. Oh. Maybe he did. Or was that Miz? It might have been X it might have been both. I don't know. Miz was basically just like ragging on me for like half the party. Gives me shit for classic. I know comes in like he owns the place. Now we're at Chipotle now. If you're cool with the people, they might not charge you. It depends on the people working, how much they care to stay on model. Yeah, I realize that's a lot of things in the States. Um, it really depends on the people. But yeah, no, the party was fun. It was really nice. I, I don't know. That's the thing where like I get it is quite nice serotonin just seeing like Iman happy and stuff and like enjoying herself or anyone's birthday like Jamie too when I went to Jamie's birthday she's just like so she's like drunk she's like happy going around whatever I'm like aren't you cold she's like nah I'm drunk I'm too drunk for that man I'm like okay <laughs> like it's just fun it's like a good time yeah you get recognized a lot when you go to places like Chipotle um not a lot i would say chipotle is not usually the place i get we get recognized like maybe the workers like very occasional here and there i've gone recognized at starbucks <laughs> um starbucks uh soup plantation um they're all random uh sometimes some grocery stores or like uh yeah it's way too random it's just it could be just wherever you go um but usually in a lot of like the asian areas yes um there's this place called uh feng cha um it's in the 626 somewhere and so i love that place i like going there often and um i would usually before there's a period of time where i would go at night i think i went like two three times at night and there's this one girl um that recognized well maybe one or two uh but she was always so excited she's like oh my god he found like blah 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 and then like she um asked for pictures and stuff and then i one time i went during the day recently i went during the day um and then one of the other workers that were like oh my god like you usually see so and so at night and like she texted in her group chat that she saw you and everything but you only come at night and i was so sad and then but now you're here during the day because because then like she has the daytime shift and i was like i got you i totally knew that i got you <laughs> yeah but she was it was really cute um actually yeah i would say like boba places are pretty common too did pokey's party have a theme like jamie's nope uh no but i went to like a matrix party later that did have a theme and they told everyone to wear black you got a radio voice i do do i have a radio voice i'm asking i'd like to know i like doing podcasts so no i think it's a crisp mic okay you know what? i didn't want a radio voice more than your voice a kid's voice yes that's so not true i have like i don't have uh the type of voice that's very alluring or like uh some girls i feel like have really pretty voices um mine is a bit more monotone or like boyish which i necessarily did not really like growing up i remember hearing myself in the in um when my voice being recorded and other things i was like oh like i don't like how that sounds
Pokey talks about her non-streamer friends on stream as well and how it makes her happy. Dude, I'm telling you, you need people in both. You need people in the streaming space, uh, for of course, like you need friends there, but you also need friends outside the streaming space. It is so refreshing and so nice where it just reminds me of how life was before I got into streaming. I when i used to go to school or when i start was just working in like a normal environment or like whatever with like my normie friends or whatever like it puts me in a place where i feel more normal at times or grounded or like not just immersed in our work and uh all that all the time and the conversations are different you're not really talking about stream you're not really talking about socials you're not talking about like not saying we do that normally but it's just like the topics that can come up just won't in like those type of uh groups and um i think that's nice yeah actually yeah it's like more of an actual break from the job mm-hmm I love it. Yeah, you get to hear about like people's lives, um, do their work, like different work that they do. So that's always interesting. No, I went to University of Calgary. My friend Derek went to Mount Royal. A moon cup to your issues that Myung bought me. We went to H Mart. And they have a Paris baguette. This is one of my favorite things at Paris baguette. This cup tiramisu is so good. I like this and their pudding, but they don't... I feel like I only see it in NorCal. I never see the Paris baguette pudding anywhere else. Not in SoCal, at least. I've not seen it here. To have it at the Irvine location, maybe it's if, it's if it's like a bigger Paris baguette. Hi, friend. Mm, this is so good. Mm, are there new videos today? I'm down to react if there are. Mm -hmm. Yummy. Happy Mother's Day. Everyone wish your mom, Taylor Swift. Your stream moms. Happy Mother's Day. Hi, Serena. Happy Sunday. Happy Mother's Day. Do you have uh, Mother's Day plans? Mm -hmm. Made breakfast for your mom, but no other plans. That's so cute. What do you end up making? Do you mean like pancakes or do you, did you make some else? Yoni, no, no, no way. She meant to put mothers at her mom's grave. Oh. You don't need context, man. Like, you can't just say that and not say the last part. Bro. Everyone was like, oh my god. Oh, I like Jubilee videos, too. I was thinking about that. I totally was just going to eat. A bit of this tiramisu, but now it's so good that I want to eat the whole thing. I'm slowly getting there. Yeah. Hi, Britain. Thank you so much for the 46 months. Welcome back. We're almost at the four year mark. <laughs> anyway, <laughs> potato pancakes and corned beef hash for your mom. That sounds fucking good. 
I actually like corned beef, but I never get it. Or I get it when there's this one place in uh, at the Grove uh, that makes it pretty good. What I do for my mom, um, I'm gonna send her cash. Cause that's what she wants. She says she wants USD, so she could um, use it for stocks and stuff. I know, very romantic, very wholesome and sentimental. He is unhinged. Investing is the best kind of love. Yeah. You know, she invested in me. And I'm sure at first, at some point, she was like, fuck. My, this is definitely dropping. I'm never going to get my money back for this. <laughs> Especially when I was like 26, 27. Just still jumping from contract work to contract work. And she had to worry about me. And she was just like, damn. Hey, just make sure you get a full-time job, okay? Like, hey, is this one okay? How much are they paying you? Hey, mom, they're paying me 3k a month. And she's like, yeah, okay, that's, um, it's better to stay, save up. Hi, uh, Bobby, thank you so much for the Prime, thank you. Are you excited for EDC? I'm so excited. I love EDC. Yeah. I'm not excited for how tired I'm gonna be, but I always love the event and stuff, so. Um. But yeah. I just know growing up, um, my mom's biggest concern, as for many parents or Asian parents in general, it was always, um, what do you wanna do? All that kind of stuff. I would say all these random things like artists. I remember. There was, n there was weird though. I never had like a specific. I wish growing up that I had more of a passion for something. I liked playing sports, but that wasn't something that I ever thought about making a career in. So, um, I remember when I was dating my boyfriend at the time, I was really jealous because not jealous, but I was envious that he had such a strong idea of what he wanted to do in life. His dad was a mechanic. He loves cars. He has such a passion for cars. So when uh we were together he was like yeah i'm gonna be a mechanic that's my dream or that's what i want to do and so i was always envious that he had such a strong idea of what it is that he wanted and so when it was time for me to apply uh into like a specific faculty when i was in high school i was just kind of like i don't know what to do and i had like a long talk with my dad and uh basically came to the conclusion that uh, I want to be a therapist or like a psychologist of some sort. Um, tried to aim for that, but did not succeed because I did not study enough in school or pay attention enough in school because I was busy playing Hearthstone, League of Legends, and watching Chinese dramas. But the um, idea was there. <laughs> Um, I, yeah, I just wish I had more passion for it. My passion was not very obvious. I love talking to people. I love helping people. But there wasn't like a specific like, uh, oh, I'm so passionate about being a psychologist, if that makes sense. There's no that I didn't feel that I just enjoyed um, the times when I help my friends or talk to people. Um, yeah, but I guess it's funny because I ended up doing something that um, does exactly that, where I love talking to people and I love trying to, like, uh, just talk about things in general that could possibly help people through my experience or maybe through, uh, hearing from other people's experiences and other things like that and sharing that. Um, hi, James. Yeah. And then I found my first passion, like, aside from sports, um, because... Well, actually, I guess I was very passionate about badminton, but that was never going to be like a career. Uh, it was just, a, I was just very passionate about that hobby. It was, I loved it. I was addicted to it. If I had to go into a sport, it'd probably be badminton if I did do it for a living or something like that, but I was just not good enough. Yeah. So I guess then there was gaming. 
And it's weird, like the passion that I had for gaming make ever made me more miserable or more meh about doing everything else. Like I didn't want to work an office job because I would just think about how I wanted to work in gaming and that was more fun for me. But maybe I was also doing jobs in general that I wouldn't like. Like maybe I would have liked bar marketing, maybe I would have liked event planning or something right which i think i would have i would have liked other things that were still regular jobs but i was just in the wrong regular job area get it do i can't do competitive badminton there's no way i'm too old and uh not enough time and i just i'm not as passionate about badminton anymore yeah i would i think event planning would be fun uh or Some type of advertising, maybe. Or I would still... Being a therapist is still great, but I don't know if I could listen to people talk now for like 10 billion years. When I think about what actually... Like, the things I like about being a therapist is I like talking and helping people. But if I had to talk to someone that I disliked or felt like they were very... Uh, like meh and i had to sit through them and try to help them i don't think i would like that the reason why i liked helping people was because i feel like there were good people and i like helping um people that i feel like would actually like if i talked to someone and i was offering them advice or giving them my insight on things and say they want to like improve as a person but throughout the time they just wouldn't or they would not even listen to me or they would uh or not take my things into consideration, I guess, and they would continue being a shitty person, then I could not... I would hate continuing to do therapy with them. So I can't be a therapist. <laughs> yeah. People have trouble taking things seriously. That's fine. You don't have to take things seriously. It's just like... But if I'm the one responsible for helping you... I would just really not want to do that. <laughs> you know? You guys see the Lily being blouse therapist clip? Really? What happened? <laughs> I'm down. Uh... I'm down. Find on YouTube. Sweet. Oh, this is not. Sorry, I realized that. My bad. No, it wasn't. It wasn't even. Yeah. Yep. And what kind of bullying did they do from the last Good, no? you told me? You, you said they uh called me mean names. Like. I think I think it wasn't that they just called me mean names. It's that they said things about me that actually had like small little bits of truth in them that I would then. That you drink toilet water tea. Is that because you told no, me? No, it wasn't. It wasn't even the like. <laughs> like drink toilet water tea, tea was like you know i i get you know like this friend lily she said that her self-esteem gets better when she turns on my stream and then everyone like kind of laughs at it and then the reality is like i have to like laugh along with it and mm -hmm. you know basically like, oh yeah like it's i, I like i like getting made fun of but then the truth is that um i it actually hurts me every time they do it inside but i can't really do anything because frankly there's a power dynamic involved right because it's so, like lily's like a bigger content creator than me Leslie, you, who bullies me, she's a bigger content creator than me. Because like, I totally understand. Yeah, Have so, you considered that you're being a little bitch? <laughs> <laughs> I was actually, I was trying to get fucking therapy. 
You know, I would say the same. I would honestly say the exact fucking same. I would just, or something really insensitive, like, I'll go, oh, because they're bigger content creators. Well, have you ever tried being a bigger content creator and then them and see how that could work, maybe? <laughs> like, maybe it's a you problem. up to it, man. It was so good. I'm victim blaming. Sorry, um, How was my acting? Because I thought that was a that was pretty, pretty good. good. Yeah, there's, was like, there was no truth like, oh, in that, yeah, by the way. Guys, right. I was just acting. No, that was. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. you were acting. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, he was acting. All right, guys, break it up. <laughs> God, this cup here makes me sleep. Opium, it's all acting. Yep. I need to stop. There's like this. <laughs> I'm really going to put this down and say, oh, this is too much. I'll stop here. <laughs> mm. No, it's fine. At least I, st I stop. <laughs> There's none left. Yeah. Well, you know, at least I'm stopping somewhere. Okay. It's better than not stopping at all. I'm saving it for later. finish it because we awesome. are starting episode 30 you know what i'm tired of people telling me how awesome scar's video is and me not watching it is it the one that's i am scara i bet it is this is so cute what do i put my camera like here Of champions. Scar uh, the e Esports poses, man, gets me every time. Since then. The legendary Scar himself. Ooh, I love it. He has the carry force here and uh, a scary force in fights. Give it up! True. For oh! Cross, yeah. My name is William Scar Lee. Scara. Scara going in high, dangerously low, jumps with the shield, flash body slam by Scara, picks up the solo kill 1v1. Look at the first damage there, Timbers does not keep him alive. He Show the ward! We want the ward clip! And we want the other clip with the interview of... Um, was it? You guys know what I'm talking about, right? The Scara interview, the famous Scara interview is the highest performer on Dignitas. You just talked about Scar Beast. That's like the one guy we know consistently can make it happen. Oh my Dang. god, did you see that one yeah. Scar up? It was definitely a really good roam by Scar right there. Scar right now is a monster. GG knew of PewDiePie, Derek, Cyrus, and Voivod, but I didn't know Scar was there. Damn. No. Hey guys, we're offline TV. Scar is <laughs> the dad of the house. <laughs> oh, this is great. I fucking love this. This is one of the top Scarra. clips. I need help. <laughs> <laughs> He's kind of the father figure of the household. That's what I'm good for on the team. Uh, a lot of people in the house consider me like the father figure. True. More off the dad. Don't say that. When <laughs> Doe said that, <laughs> Wait, there's no chair. That's true. Oh, there's. You have to sit on Danny Scar's lap. Oh, fuck. <laughs> <laughs> what is wrong with you, Dad? Oh. I'm oh, getting angry, Scar, tonight. Hey, guys. It's Scar. <laughs> I thought so. Holy. Asked you a two third. <laughs> what is you see this? Where Scar is? Yeah. Oh, did you not notice Scar just body slam his bed? 
Damn, Peter looks no, he's like. Good, he's good. What does Peter look like? A. He kind of looks like he he's like a radio person or like an interviewer. Why does he give me that vibe? Like he's like a talk show host or uh, some type of host. He's good. Oh my God, Scar, stop! Mm. Oh my God, Scar. I just remember him taking like almost 14 plus shots of vodka and he was fine. She, she <laughs> day drinking. Day drinking. Day dr <laughs> hey, that's a good clip. I told you I can't do that. usually drinks. Yeah, yeah, I think that's what it is. Peter looks respectable. What? He actually looks like I would respect back to someone like him but i that's so weird drinks vodka so weird. Yeah. that's true don't that's say that is believe it on like camera a, a nice dog has helped scar through a lot of his issues and internal demons <laughs> He just wants to drink. Stop joking about that. People are going to think you're serious. Run <laughs> by Santa Scara. This alone is a, a Scara picks picture, I think. You, you're right. This is in a very, in a very festive mood today. Yeah, I could so tell. That's what happened to RoboDog. Yep. Is this not how you normally you look like around the offline house? Well, just know RoboDog pissed off Scara. That's why you don't see him anymore. I think that's how people like to imagine me. Uh, so I like to live out to their fantasies sometimes. Okay, nice. So well, I'm happy you're fulfilling people's fantasies here. What is this conversation? Wait, Scar's oh done so many cosplays. What? Wait, I don't remember him doing that many cosplays. Like, he's done a billion times more than me. Well, I haven't done a lot, but that's you know what I mean? Weird. You really grab the best outfit for yourself. That's kind of selfish. <laughs> How many have you I'm even done? Like, two, three? three? Yeah. What the f happened today, Michael? Uh, how's how's streaming going, man? Oh How my are you doing? god, I can't look at you. Can't me. look at me in the eyes. In right? the eyes. It's weird. It's really weird. Merry Christmas. Merry really? Christmas. I feel like I would only be able to look at Michael in the eyes. Like I would not want to see Thank the. You. It's the best gift I've got today. Surrounding things. Am I turning red, dude? I'm sorry, man. You see his guns? Are you serious? <laughs> what? Oh, oh my god. god. Yeah, you've been a naughty girl. Oh. <laughs> I did not ever in my life need to hear that from Scar. I feel like as soon as I open this, it's gonna explode. Yeah, I it's know. It's a body pillow. <laughs> oh my. That is definitely not a rag. That is just a food rag. My rag is behind me. Wait, what do you mean, Scar? Oh, no! No, guys, not the pillow. I would never. No, 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 no. Peter. Tell me one thing you love about Scar. I like the shape of his compliment. chin. Okay, and Scar, name one thing you love about Peter. I like the shape of his. You want to see my? <laughs> no, shot. He said that, bro. Dude, Scar is the most random, like left field shit. There's He's no so unhinged. No, 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 no. no I, I stream no, stream no. There's nothing. No, no, no. There. Feel it. Just feel yeah. it first. Okay, just you're feeling it. Yeah. Okay, ready? Three, two, one. Mm-hmm. Oh, Eton Scara! Eton Scara! Can I slap you on the face of the fucking? What the? <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, Lily. <laughs> Thanks, Scara. Shout out to Don Scara for uh, letting me borrow his cat ears. I knew you were a furry. Scara, I swear, every time Scara wakes up and chooses violence, he comes to my chat. I'm trying to yep. get friendly with Mimi. That's not possible. I'm streaming! I stand by what I say. Oh, Scara! <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, show me. Get him, get him. That was great. Did you tell them about yours yet? Hmm? 
Hey, what's up, guys? Oh, I already messed it up. <laughs> this is my new, new model. We're gonna have a good time. Damn. <laughs> Scar's cute oh, model, his this like model it. looks fucking yeah. crazy. <laughs> I knew it! I knew it! Uh, ara, ara. Yeah. Oh. Someone, someone drew art for me. It's really oh. nice. Speaking of art, <laughs> Peter got me this for my birthday. This is so good. Wait, what? Oh my god, the old OTV shirts. Scara, I'll never forget our night in Paris. Oh, Scara was what? crazy. Oh, oh my god. Please give you a present. I love that. Oh, it's cute as hell. It's my VTuber Wait, that's model. So that's really accurate. Yeah, it's really cute. It's really cute. I it myself. Oh, what? Yeah. That is crazy. Look at this. How famous do I have to be to get free stuff from you guys? You have to be Scara. I would only give free things to Scara. <laughs> Wow! Scar is a fucking Giga Chad. Really good. Oh, so like her shade, but it's cute as fuck. Hey, what's up, guys? Yeah, as he walks through the crowd like a fucking boss. Who is he? Oh, we'll put it over the bed. Oh my god, Yay. Scar! He's like, That's yeah, no worries, guys. No worries. Is this me and you? I always think it's nice when people give me gifts. But not expected. Someone got me. Is this what I think it is? Uh, it's a heater yeah. with my body Why? pillow. Oh, I open it, but I this is great. I will, I'll sleep it's with my... this. I got so many packages this time. You got me a box. Oh, it's the cutest shit I've ever seen. Hey, Scara, this is for you. What? I don't know. It's for OTV, but I'm pretty sure. I'm it's a for gamer you. dad, just like a normal dad, but cooler. Oh. You're a gamer dad. I, 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 I love it. I can see Scar as a dog. The idea of kids would be nice. Little legends. They're, little they're legends. legends. <laughs> 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 Who's my favorite little legend? <laughs> Is it you, little one? Oh, I did it. So, I'm so good at this game, dude. Should Why I? are you coaching me? What the? I don't know how to do that. Oh you look hideous. <laughs> It's so good. <laughs> Lock in. You know, I really uh, top for I thinking of that. Really up top. Okay, I'm gonna go up there and beat your ass unless you watch it. <laughs> <laughs> what? <laughs> Wait, what did you say? Okay, I'm gonna go up there and beat him. That dude. <laughs> Lock in that chair. I really, uh, I think it would be a really good I really scar. Okay, I'm gonna go up there and beat your ass unless you watch it. <laughs> 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 she insta locks it. <laughs> Are you joking me, Scara? <laughs> what is this? Can you give me a pep talk? You remember, if you die in game, you die in real life. Wow, it's like sword art. <laughs> Sounds good. That was the pep talk I needed. You guys who are new, who haven't seen Split Game before, watch this. I can't get over how Scar just like, like, does not give. Like shamelessly just wears the cum shirt. Wait, 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 no, no, no. I mean, watch this, watch this. That would be really sick if I do it all in one go. You guys are Huh? Um. Iskar, what up? Um. What I have gathered from this video is you still have. You have a. Uh, long-term drinking problem uh you probably invented the lcs pose and you've done more cosplays than me somehow and you're a furry and i heard things here that i did not need to hear um and you're kind of Kind of giga chat here. The part where you're fucking. Hey, it's right here. Where you're just like. But it's cute as fuck. Walking through the crowd. Oh, what's up, guys? Hey. They're like, they're all like, scar, scar, scar. And you're like, yep, yep, yep. You know, put it over the bed. All in one go. I'm sorry. Yeah. No worries, man. I'm able to get oh. my bombs by looking at- 
Gara finds a way to make the impossible possible. <laughs> you dumb mother! <laughs> you dumb mother! <laughs> no, Scarlet! Try to throw me off and throw yourself off! <laughs> this game is essentially... Uh, the left, like, press the left mouse button, throw it at the other player. Uh-huh. But between the... I just, just wanted to shove my... Throw it <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Dude, hmm. Some people are just lucky. They're blessed by the god of. I thought that I was a different level when it came to these type of games, but Scara managed to beat me. What? And other people are me. Oh, number two. No, no, like, like. Oh! 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 Wait. 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 What? Oh, got it, got it. Did so you? Are you able to oh, hurt wait, someone you with out, the plane? Wait, Scara! Scara! Wait, Scara! Why, why do you keep picking the worst pilot? Why do you keep? Why do you do this? What happened? You see the beam? Yeah. Okay, so that's um the that's the accelerator. So we're gonna bank off the beam and go to the plant right in front of us. So jump in like right as soon as we go. Jump right now. Jump right now. <laughs> <laughs> Why is that beam there? God damn! Let me get some water. That's really cool. Oh, that 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 water is ice cold. <laughs> I had like the blood in my veins. She. Oh my god, I can't believe I did that. I would still. This is a dark buff to. Alright, I just need a moment to recover from that. That's uh, that was a lot. Ooh. Ooh. Yeah, let me just. Uh, <laughs> let me just chill a bit. Whoa. Oh. Oh. Okay. <laughs> Why did I drink water? <laughs> Here, I'll drink with you. There's mail literally outside. I, I'm gonna bring it in. I'm gonna show you guys what people put outside my room. A whole humidifier that I was supposed to set up two months ago. Oh my god! <laughs> that's a, that's like is that was that? Was that the, um, the bed? It's, uh, fuck, what was it called? It's like a bed, too, that would absorb all of that and take fucking long-ass time to dry. Like, it wasn't like a regular bed. Like a cotton bed or it's something. It's like fire with water that just spilled on my bed. <laughs> I'm the judge. It's the like judge. one of, like, the gel, like, so super soft, like, whatever type of beds. The executioner, right here. Oh. Mm-hmm. Oh, what? Okay, uh, dude, just Okay, jump. we have to have... There's gotta be the... The sage clip. Someone with a shorty in the corner. Did not Nara? expect that. Oh my fucking god! He has a shorty in the offense? Skara, where the fuck was the interview? For League? And where was the ward clip? You're gonna make a best of Skara video and not put in the ward clip or the... The, the tomorrow bigs whatever uh interview are you serious jesus scar just freaked out luckily we have daddy scar to take care of us <laughs> uh, we're gonna fight nice oh my I hope leslie never says die ever again i don't think i should have hit that one but okay oh God, please don't die let's go oh, all right i feel like you shot two people in the crotch and they died yeah <laughs> so you ever heard of cbt what is CBT? <laughs> I'm just uh, no, don't worry about it. Wait, what is it? <laughs> what's CBT? <laughs> Guys, what is CBT? Oh, is it the cock and ball torture? Yeah, okay, yeah, I got it. Yeah, oh I remember now. 
Hey, no, dude. Oh. <laughs> Cognitive behavior therapy clues. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> ah! Hello. <laughs> what is that? It's just oh, jeez. So oh, thank God you're here. Oh man, I was stuck here for the longest time, Scar. What do you mean it stuck here? It was a here? monster. Y yeah, it killed Ooh. me. Oh. Well, that's, that's a person. Bad, that... huh? <laughs> Happiness is the most important thing. So, if someone's like, "Hey, you made my day better. Hey, you made me happy today." Really, can I ask for more? Yeah, maybe. But do I need more? Not really. Ah, nice kayak clip. There he goes, drinking again. The piss cup. <laughs> what is this? I've made my choice. I think I've seen enough. That's a great Sometimes thing. I, think. I, just... I also think. Yeah, maybe I've also seen enough. <clears throat> Gara's cup still cleaner than blouse tea. Hey, let's go. Damn, that was a good video. That brings back so many good memories. Damn it. I'm in a the ward clip. Oh, you guys want to see the ward clip? All right. Scar up ward clip. <laughs> this one ward clip it's literally like a like a thir 30 second video or less it has a, almost a million views i wonder go ahead and ward over here wow can i really not get the ward over there's a ward range on this <laughs> I hate this game so much. Oh my god. And that that's just how it was for like And that for some reason that ward clip just like throughout time just never went away. It was just it would just always come up. And uh the casters would talk about it, they would replay that ward clip or all the kind of stuff everywhere. It was Oh I'm down. Run! Thanks hey, what's for up, guys? the it's Scar. raid. Um, Savalo. <laughs> Here with, I was about to say TSM double lift, but with Happy Mother's Day! Can you tell your mom Happy Mother's Day for for all of us? Because she always makes us delicious food. Double and lift here. Uh, and so. Do you know what time it's at, Keone? Your mom. No, your mom. It's the first clip. Okay. Yes. Because this word is actually hard to do. Oh my god. It's so hard to do. Peter, I'm wearing my validate old him. hoodie from like middle school. It is hard like, to wear. It's so oh hard to do. Oh my god. Wow. Only two wards. You are greedy, man. You need to buy more. Oh. <laughs> I'm a mid laner. That's this two more than you dude, get. I'm not gonna lie. Like when I referenced the scar word on TSM, no one fucking knew what I was talking about. Really? Are you serious? Yeah, like like because all the zoomers, right? Like like Spica, he's not gonna know what the scar award is. But the yeah, no way Ming does not know what the scar award is. Everybody knows what the scar award is. They showed it everywhere. Oh, huh? I'm looking at Jubilee videos. And one of them is, who had sex first? Who lost their virginity first? How are you going to know that?
how are you gonna know this too who has not orgasms versus one fake are they trying to ask each other how it feels or what six married men versus one secret fuck boy ranking by divorces Some of, I'm not sure. Huh. How are we suddenly here? Well, I was looking at videos and like, oh yeah, like we can react to videos and stuff. And then it's just like, what is this? Ah, uh, I did remember this sugar baby episode. Should I tell her? She doesn't know I'm her mom. I feel like I'm on Jerry Springer. But then again, maybe you guys don't know what that is anymore. Maybe I should not reference that so people... So my age doesn't show. Ranking people by age. Honestly, that's fine. Ranking his ex? Which ex is the best in bed? I'll click it. <laughs> that was the party yesterday. It was good. I mean, like, all the parties have been great so far. And, I don't know, Iman's party felt like a carnival. Like, there was things, so many things that she had there. Can women choose his perfect match? Dating six glow up girls? Wiping 20 girls for her son? Oh, nothing beats, um, MILF Mansion or whatever. Like the one that's like, uh, that was like her. <laughs> Did I tell you guys about the show? Basically, I was at OTV. Uh, Sid or someone bought the show on YouTube and one of them uh, or no not one of them uh, so at first you see the show it has all of like the moms there or like MILFs right and halfway through the first episode they're like alright we'll bring in the bring in the boys and they and you, you they interview them throughout previously they're and they're kind of like oh yeah like i like younger guys because blah 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 and they give their reasonings for it and then they bring in the guys and the guys are all of the mom's sons they're all of each other's sons and then so the sons pretty much are like you're on this dating show yeah, the show is so cursed. Uh, your your son or your mom is one of the contestants and you just have to see them mingle with other people, like with each other and all that kind of stuff. And they had... Uh, um, the It was already so bad because the activity they had them do was... What show? <laughs> nothing to do. It's like, I'm going to go because I had nothing to do. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to watch that show. Um, the first acti One of the first activities were uh the all the sons lined up in a row and without their shirts uh so shirts are off and each mom had to be blindfolded and feel up each of the guys to find out which one is her son so she's feeling up all these guys and then she she's like this one's like him and then yeah and they all do that that's that's like an activity that they did or like a thing that they did it's so wrong. Link so I can avoid it. <laughs> yeah, tell me about it. Strongly disagree. Some would agree. Some would disagree. I would agree. Disagree. We brought together six exes who all dated this guy. Hey, I'm Josh. And had hey, to Josh. Each other based on how good they think they were in bed. First, we started with Deepix. I had a pretty bad experience. Okay. Then we had their ex rearrange them by how good they actually were. 
This wow. is ranking. We, I think we need the show name. Hey, I'm Josh. Yes, their mom's underwear? No way. Hi, I'm Brian, Josh's ex. I'm Sam. I'm Samantha. I'm April. I'm Jessly. I'm Josh's <laughs> ex. I'm Antonio. How do you guys feel like Josh is going to rank you guys? I think Josh is going to be a little bit more of like an emotional Aww. card, like connection. I think Josh is like based on how much fun he has. Me personally, I have a high ego, so I feel like he, not only will he keep my ego up, but he'll also explain the great memories that him and I had. So next hmm. step is that I'm going to take Josh out of here. Okay. Hi, Josh. Hi, Josh. Yeah. I gotta go this way. Oh, okay, God. Bye. I'm scared. We all seen each other naked, so it's like, that's what's weird about this. I mean, this whole thing is weird. Like, of course, you need the concept of the show, right? Can you talk about how we first met, Josh? Oh, yeah. I'm a gardener. And I would always a gardener. <laughs> Why does that sound so funny? The way he introduced himself. He didn't even say my name is like blah blah or like yeah we met through. I'm a gardener. So what? Do you just fuck your gardener? <laughs> like walk by when I was outside in the front yard. I see him. I see him walking outside. Wow. I see him walking outside. It's like not even like a yeah. He works at Target. I see him working there. He's like I see him walking. I worked at Dunkin' Donuts. Walk by when I was outside in the front yard. I met him at my job. I worked at Dunkin' Donuts, and mm -hmm. he just come in a lot. And then I would just see him more frequently coming in. And then we just started talking more. And more. Damn, you can pick up girls at Dunkin' Donuts. I've known him for a long time too. We went to school together. We were each other's firsts. We both like were at the same concert, and then my ride unfortunately bailed on me and Josh was like oh hey like I can of course he can take you home yeah and then we just continued talking after that one day while being in the same class as Josh we were partnered up together and through that Josh's personality just kind of like swam me up swam me up my feet Josh really had every angle and thing in occupation slash scenario with him i thought i officially <laughs> could call him my first friend until i found out that he cheated on me i give him a second chance of being my friend because of the connections that we had having to relive that mr like worldwide be and i would like to be friends with him i think based off what we think or how good we thought it was that's how we can tell what josh thought maybe yeah I wonder how often it is someone thinks, wow, that sex was great. And someone thinks and of uh, the other person is just like, eh, eh. I mean, I've heard it happen to like a lot of girls because a lot of, um, mm. you know. But other than that, I wonder how often that happens. Moses Trust, thank you so much for the 27 months. Welcome back. Thank you. So, like, who actually I had do a not good mean me. Or, that sounds bad. Okay. <laughs> but who had good experience? I think, with okay, I don't think I had, like, the best experience, but I don't think, it, like, I was, had, like, the worst experience. Like, I have pretty good memories. Were we Josh. all off and on with him? I was off and on with him. Were, you <laughs> Were we all off and on with him? Oh my god, this is trauma bonding. I was off and on with him. I was, I was or was it just, like, one continuous time and then done? Mm -hmm. I wasn't off. Josh was just playing, man. Okay, so who thinks- Josh was just playing, man. Yo, he didn't take me, the gardener, seriously. They had, like, the worst Hi, Ricky. I had a pretty bad experience. Okay. Just to... <laughs> <laughs> okay, two guys. Wait, who I said? Oh, uh, okay. Just... <laughs> <laughs> Say a okay, bad experience. Do you guys want to, like, compare so we know, like- Um, with me, this dude, every time we would, you know, he would be tense, though. He would be so what? Stiff. Is it just bad for everyone? <laughs> I would die if I did this video and I saw this after and I was like, and they were all like, is she just bad with everyone? I'd be like, excuse me. <laughs> Whoa. Whoa. Is tense worse than that is uh, is tense worse than crying? <laughs> <laughs> oh my god what is happening here who is this man who is this guy 
They all look good trauma bond over how awful the sex was. Then crying. He cried? Josh cried. No way, man. It was my first time with a guy, because I was just I was exploring things. He Did cried afterwards. <laughs> oh, oh. With our relationship, we went, we converted our relationship into fun music. We went that, we did that for a great couple of four months. I hope this isn't too personal, but first we started with Beepix. We convert, we wait, what? With our relationship, we went, we converted our relationship into fun music. Into what? Words. <laughs> with our relationship, we went, we converted our relationship into fun music. We went. It sounds like he says into funions. Fun things? I th I hear funions. <laughs> How does man get seven X's degrees? Well, it's like a video. It could be interesting. And people don't care. I thought we did that for a great couple of months. I hope this isn't too personal, but first we started with feet pics. And uh -huh. then... People who do like some feet pics, like... They're better at enjoy sex. They're better at sex? Yeah, like statistically speaking, also people like, who send feet pics are better at sex. You you do research on that? I think I should go lower. Anyone into feet who can confirm or deny? Also, why did he say that? Does he like is he into feet and feel like he's better at sex? I think I want to switch with you. Yeah. Okay. I'd back you up with me too. The best way to collectively, collectively gauge where we're at is how many bad experiences we had with him. Mm -hmm. And then whoever has the most, obviously, is in the last. I'm like a really awkward person. Like I laugh and like un when I'm in uncomfortable situations, you know? And there was like a time like after uh, we had sex and it was like just like silence and I just started laughing. And I felt so bad at that. I feel like that kind of ruined it. So maybe I want to switch with you. Like, it was just awkward. I feel like I definitely helped Josh explore his sexual journey. Generally, he had a good time, so I would put myself higher. Okay. Hmm. He said it was awful, but he felt like the other person had a good time. Okay. Do you want to switch? With, where do yeah, you want to go? I'll go next to Pablo. Cause oh, I, wow. Wow. He. Wow. He is confident. Okay. I'll push you guys down. You were, oh, you were I'm just confident. I I'm confident. Dude, you yeah. just said that like you had like so a. Bad. It was okay. Yeah, you said you were the worst one. So yeah. It was bad sometimes, For, but it was good other times. I do see myself at the top because. Are you yes, thinking of your just you yourself? <laughs> <laughs> what am I watching, bro? Top or your relationship with Josh at the top. I feel both. like you're just I'm thinking I'm of I'm you. I'm, and I'm, you, I'm but including both. Like how I said, I do have a high ego, but I am including both just to be. But fair. you have to think about what Josh thinks, and if he cheated on you. Like, did he really? Yeah, if he cheated on you, did he have a good time? Or maybe he was just like a meh person, but you know what I mean? Um, that is a very good question. Hey, good on her for bringing that up. I value that relationship. I think that part was really confusing to me. He still thought of his relationship with Josh so, like, high. It was pretty difficult to communicate with Josh. Like, I'd try to. It'd just be kind of awkward. Like, he just, like, brush it aside yeah and that's why like, i was also thinking like did you with them someone there we disagree with that because with the conversations that him and i had we're pretty sentimental which was another reason why i gave josh a second opportunity of him being my friend it feels like difficult to like hear that because like <laughs> okay sorry like i tried really hard and then it just like to hear that it was like that with other people oh. i had a whole picture painted of josh i was like pretty overwhelmed and i i even was Sorry, getting like teary eyed talking about it. Do you think this is what? That's a feels possible? bad. I think we're okay, but we're still yeah, I think, yeah. Yeah, you're, you're locking it in. Wow. I would rather die than do this. I would rather, like, be disintegrated by like a flamethrower or something than have to have my exes see how I rank them. <laughs> what? Oh, it's um interesting order. So first of all, 
I think me and you both know like what I'm gonna do here. Um, Sam. Can yeah, I don't know who could actually back. do this. You gotta switch it back, okay? Okay. I don't know if like when you were in here talking to them, you explained like. I told them we had a nuanced relationship and that yeah. sometimes it was better than others. Did you have an idea of what you were gonna do when you came in here? This is. He moved him from there to. Yeah, I was a little too confident. He was a little too confident. It's the only idea I had so far. Kind of. <laughs> <laughs> only idea. <laughs> he said this is the only idea I had so far. That's the one that he's sure of. <gasps> My guy is just devastated. <laughs> Maximum research is a uh, three years. Welcome back, happy three. Oh my god, his face, bro. <laughs> I don't need to say anything more. It was terrible. I'm gonna like, <laughs> April, like go to the front a little bit so I can okay. think about that. Like Where? maybe next Pablo, okay. or Antonio, whatever name you want to use. I'm gonna have Pablo come down right here. Right here. Okay, I'm gonna have you two switch places. Us two? Yeah. Jesse, you know our whole thing. Yeah. We were like, well, like. It's See, he can't weird. give me. A oh my god. It's kind of weird when it comes to us too, like. No, because yeah. I'm kind of no, because. She's triggered. She's so triggered. <laughs> this is. <laughs> Bro, I'm trying to think like, in what world would you would this would? How did they find people who are down for this? Like, to even have enough people too. Cause let me think, let me think, like... It's just awkward, there's so many situations where like you would never call up an ex and be like, hey, would you go on the show so I could rank how our sex was compared to my other exes. Okay. Like, we're just... Yeah. Uh, you can't... You personally, no, 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 like... No, 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 you still can't communicate. No, that's my thing, okay. You still can't communicate, and that's like so, like, annoying. Of course, I'm going to have a big reaction because yep. till this day, he's still not communicating with me. I felt like we got nowhere. There was hostility. They have every right to like be mad at me, I guess. Okay, I'm going to switch Pablo and Brian. Whoa. Okay. Whoa. Oh. And I think you're a good person, right? It's just sometimes things don't always work out with people. Brian's pretty the good. The people who are confident, like, were ended up being the worst to the other guy and the people who were not confident in themselves at all ended up being the best. How's that possible? Well, maybe it's because of their overconfident that they didn't really care as much or did as much in bed. Because they're like, this is good enough. Like, I can't like show you, but that'd be, <laughs> that'd be bad. I guess you liked me. Or you liked it. It, it. I think I might yeah. like you too, actually. Me and Pablo? Yeah. Dang. <laughs> no, you're getting, you're making Pablo have a big head again. April, we know. I didn't even have to move you that much. Like you were already up there, I think, when we started. Really? I don't know. That's crazy. Cause they, I think she said they were each other's first. It's actually like, I would just assume that each other's first, like you don't really know what you're doing. They, they, did you tell them like the our virginity stuff? <laughs> That was a I, long story. I didn't go into details. I just thought we were each other's first. So that's why I, I kind of like rank her more. I don't know. I know that's unfair. It's just like, that's how I think about things. Mm. I think I'm going to keep Sam definitely right here. <laughs> I mean, that's not unfair. It's just like how the sex is to you, right? If the emotional connection plays that big of a part, then of course it's going to be better than others, no? Right? I think I'm definitely going to keep Sam. I think he keeps up definitely here. <laughs> Dude, the gardener is getting mowed down, man. He's getting absolutely fucking ran over. You haven't explained it. I mean, it was bad. Check up on Sam after this. I told everyone that it was my first time. It wasn't mine. He said that... Didn't he say that... It was Josh's first experience with him, like, with a guy. And then now he's saying he's not? Yeah, maybe switch Brian and Pablo, actually. 
Thank you. Then, then this is good. This Thank is good. You. This is good. Are you sure? No, like, you, you cheated on Pablo. I, okay, so, so it is kind of like I do feel bad though, but at the same time, like, it wasn't yeah, my you fault. You should. I like. It wasn't your fault. It wasn't my fault. I feel bad, but it wasn't my fault, bro. What is this guy saying? It doesn't get better. It does not. I feel like you cheated? What? We don't have to get into that like that. Your life can stay there. We don't? It's Personally, not that straightforward. This is good for me. Like, I don't want to move anything. This is a good learning lesson being in a room with people. We've all, well, I've seen you guys naked. You guys haven't seen each other naked. <laughs> okay, but I think this is Why a good does he say it like that? Just say like that with the people I've had sex with. Like, why does he say, I've seen you all naked? Like, bro. <laughs> like, that's, that's, you already know that. Here, like, I think it taught us that you are kind of like a big red flag. Oh, honestly, uh, yeah. Yeah. kind of. You're just like, yes, like you, you have a lot of things you need to work on. I like her. You need help. I feel like she did what I couldn't do. Yeah, really. really do. Like a lot. That's okay. Like, what made you think? Like that? a lot. Maybe don't cheat on people. Maybe learn how to communicate your feelings. What did this experience teach you? I'm really all over the place, and I need to like fix that. Like, if someone's gonna enter my life, I need to make sure like everything's got a strong foundation. Yes. And personally, like I made some mistakes, and they did too. I should change things, obviously. I need to change some things. Am I still allowed to move people? I'm gonna give you two minutes to lock this in. Okay, I'm gonna switch you two again. Again? S yeah, I'm sorry. Hey. Personally, the things I'm into, these people play into them more, like submissiveness, I guess. Like, I don't know, aggressiveness comes into play, kind of. I don't really want to dive into that. Like, those are like things people like in bed. Mm -hmm. They play into that role more than you guys, I guess. Yeah. yeah. Now, I'm good with this now. Okay. Josh is ranking group ranking. Okay. I see. Uh, Kuroi Kaneki, thank you so much for the one year. Welcome back. Happy one year. From second to last is so funny. Dude, there, he was just so confident. How? Uh, isn't there a Taylor Swift song about being another notch on his belt? I think so. Josh, it's almost reversed. Uh little extra surprise i asked all of your exes to rank you on a scale of one to ten <laughs> <laughs> sam gave you a two. Oh, wow, oh really? oh my god jessly gave you a six. Oh, that's good i guess i'm fine with that he's a two samantha <laughs> gave you a six pablo gave you a 6.5 oh really <laughs> ryan gave you a seven April gave you a six. Yeah. Damn. That's a, uh, that's kind of a bad average he's got. So he's mid. <laughs> so he's mid. <laughs> Bro, he's like worse than mid. There's like people that gave him twos. Like he's definitely not even below. There's like some sixes, but the twos drag him hella down. He's below mid. There's like a thing going on there. It's common. Yeah, average is around how five. How do you feel now that they've given you a ranking? I mean, ranking them was fun, but I know how it feels now, like, being in their shoes. Does he? Let me calculate this. I kinda suck. That's I a 4.5. Okay, so you calculated it. Yeah. Oh, that's good, I guess. I'm fine with that. Yeah, 4.5. Um... I know how it feels now, like, being in their shoes. I kind of God. Me and Josh. It just shows like, I, I really think, yeah, people could definitely interpret the sex differently, especially if you've had like experiences afterwards that allow you to kind of like, uh, be able to differentiate more or have like better judgment in terms of how you, yeah, to make comparisons, yes. Definitely gives fuckboy vibes. Oh yeah, for sure. That guy had issues. The thing I feel about, um... Uh... I think a lot of people can be very avoidant or just want to move on to the next thing very quickly. So... What is that? Um... They're just trying to be distracted. Yes, trying to be distracted. So a lot of times they're not over their last relationship or they're not over like 
a lot of things they haven't improved themselves as like a person they haven't fixed the things that um or tried to fix the things that uh fucked up like previous relationships and all this stuff and they're like jumping into other relationships before they're even like good themselves and so i think that just ruins a lot of future relationships but i think sometimes the need to be distracted over like is that much more for people to not really think about that the gardener was crazy that was that was epic okay i need a pee i'll be back your beat yeah i'm gonna go through some more jubilee videos that was fun
Um, oh, one sec. One sec. Kiyomi, thanks for getting us up to Alma. Thank ya. Thank you. Thank you, thank you. Alright, um... We can go. Hi, Regina. Uh, so many and Mimi look kind of similar because they're both ragdolls. Uh, Mimi is a... a blue by color... or... Yeah, I think it's a blue by color. Um, and then Somi is a seal links by color. Do they shed a lot? They shed like a okay amount. I don't know how to describe it. On like a level of one to ten, I would say it's kind of like maybe like a six or a seven they don't they they shed an okay amount like sometimes i'll have cat hair on my clothes and stuff but it's also not to the extent where like it's all cat hair um i do have some shirts that were like that but it's weird i feel like i haven't had that recently um it's almost as if somi just st started shedding less but, um Michelle has oh yes Michelle um and Andy both have a ceilings by color too but he's a boy um trying to pick the next video The penis one. They all decide which one's the best match. Oh, that's a cool shirt. This is terrifying. I'm not gonna lie. That is. I like that shirt. Thank you. Thank you. We'll name him today. He hasn't been named yet. Melvin? No. Oh, nobody left? Better. <laughs> Damn. What the reason? Okay, who's popping the drinks? <laughs> Guys, I'm 19. So you can't have two. Okay. I can't <laughs> have that one. But does anyone want sight? I'm gonna spit out my water or my drink. He's 19 and he's on a dating show like this? I'll, I'm just, like the bartender just, just today. Feels wrong. One, two, three, okay. What's your favorite thing about yourself? I feel like I can tell like pretty good dad jokes Ooh. sometimes. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, okay. Okay. What do you call a cow with no legs? They have it on Yes Style. I want it. <laughs> Ground beef. Ground beef. <laughs> okay. Okay. What do you What do you call a cow with three legs? Tri tip. Oh. Oh. That's a good one. Cheers. 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 Do you guys like movies? I. I would leave. Like, yes, yes. yes. Like What's movie? your favorite movie? Or top three. As a kid, my favorite. No, not X's. Uh, so there's ten girls are. It's basically like IRL. Uh, 
dating app, I guess. Like, they all swipe right on him, and then now he's just talking. The movie was Forrest Gump, just because oh, it was okay. really, like, it was really fun. Do you like Marvel? I do. <gasps> okay. Love Wait, who's your favorite superhero? Spider-Man. Okay, classic. Spider -Man. Which Spider-Man, though? Andrew Garfield. I'm sorry. Me too. Oh, yeah, Andrew Garfield's not a bad one. <laughs> no, that movie was like made for like the female gaze. So I'm, I'm so happy. That <laughs> female <laughs> gaze. Who's your celebrity crush? If, let me think. Um, like Toby is classic, right? But my favorite Spider-Man is probably it's kind of different because tom holland portrays spider-man as more of like a kid in the comics was spider-man more of like a kid or more of an adult because he was supposed to be he was working at the paper or at the newspaper so he was more an adult right wasn't spider-man like a photographer or like a like a news both actually there's a specific comic where it's about him in high school. He's freelance. He's a photographer. He's a student. Both? Oh. Okay. Took pictures of himself like a Twitch streamer. I see. Okay. Hmm. I like both Andrew Garfield and Tom Holland. Crush. The most, I think. And then, but yeah. There's this golfer, her name's Lily Hu, and she's my celebrity crush, I'm like, if you're watching this, <laughs> don't hit me up. Ten girls don't hit me up. Ten. That's what I was going to say, like, don't hit me up, like. Are you currently, like, studying anything? Yeah, I'm studying, uh, I'm majoring in PR at USC, Ooh. and then I'm minoring in computer programming. Oh, nice. Do you have any mm. hobbies? Yeah, so, like, I'm into photography, and I've done, like, oh, some pretty cool shoots with that. Have um, you been in mm. any relationships? I have, I have. And how long? How were they? How long? <laughs> how long? How were they? Uh, about a year. Why did it end? Mm. <laughs> yeah, so something just happened. I think I saw something that I shouldn't have seen. So. Like through the phone type? Through the phone on Instagram. So phone. On Instagram, oh. Oh, I saw it on my phone. Oh. Yeah. Oh. Wait, 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 what's your sign? What's your sign? How did he oh, see it on Libra? his phone? Oh, okay, yeah, yeah. You're Libra? Libra. Yeah. yeah. Me too. Great. <laughs> Yo, how many Libras are there here? Oh my god. Wait, okay, so do you have like a hot take? Okay, I'm gonna need like a subject. Libra. Though. Like I, I don't have this music. One. When I first listened to him, I I didn't get the hype about Frank Ocean. I'm not gonna lie. I'm not gonna lie. Um I mean I honestly still don't really see like a hype thing, but that's because it's not like he's not my personal personal taste, but uh there are songs that I've heard that are by him. I'm like, oh, I know this song. Um, and I don't think badly of it or anything. I just don't love it to that degree. Yeah. Like, it's just, it's, I, I'm indifferent. No, like, it's, it's good. Like, it's good music, but everyone yeah. on Twitter is like, oh my God, like, like they cry to him like every day. Or okay. day. So, what about so what's your top three? Yeah. Top three? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. The Marias. I like the oh, Marias. Love Blackpink. Blackpink. I love <laughs> uh, <laughs> Baby Keem. Yeah. <laughs> I didn't go to Coachella though. I wish I did. I saw BTS that weekend though. Oh, wait, you went to Vegas? Yeah. Oh, I'm so jealous. I was gonna go, but I went to Coachella weekend two instead. Where are you guys from? I'm from Victorville. <laughs> I'm from Colorado. Out of state? Yeah. Did you move here? Or? Yeah, for school. I go to UCSD. UCSD. So you had, like, you had to like, drive here. Yeah. yeah. I'm from the Bay. Originally, yeah. See, that's a red flag. No, I'm just kidding. Oh, <laughs> oh, 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 oh my god. Orange County, like Laguna Beach area. Another red flag. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> I'm, just, I'm, just... I'm from Fresno, but I go to UCLA, which is going to be another red flag because we're rivals. <laughs> <laughs> the door's over there. <laughs> I don't know. Uh, Jerry, you don't seem interested. Yeah. Y'all hit me with a bus. Well, that's my personality. Yeah. I'm not, it's the age. <laughs> but he's cute. <laughs> There's some the people age. that are like pretty long distance from him. So that might be like a, uh, yeah. does anybody He's selling them back down. He's like, like hey something. guys, this could be long distance. You guys gotta pull out. Like, we uh, can't have everyone here. Wrong with the age difference. I'm 23, so I'm a little bit older. Oh, yeah. Yeah. He's 19 or 23. <laughs> I mean, so far. 
Yeah, it's kind of also weird if you can drink and you're legal and stuff like that and they can't. Like, the younger it is, the weirder it is. That's just how I feel. Like, like if you're if they're 19, I just don't feel like you could do it. Even if you're 23, you know what I mean? Like, I feel like the it's okay if you're like 20. Even 21, the, the difference in this age or problem is just like the legal age or drinking thing. Like the, a two year difference is not typically, you know what I mean? Like that bad um, at all, but yeah. Or I'm like, you probably have a lot of, uh, more in common right now. Oh yeah, the whole K-pop thing. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Maybe I love even just a couple things. <laughs> <laughs> like really feeling it, and they're like, yeah, I definitely I think we're all in love with him. Yeah. <laughs> oh. Wow. I can hold one year not drinking to date someone. Yeah. But that's why I was like, two years is kind of like, one year is fine. I think 19, 20, or like 20, 21, like fine. But I think it's harder at that age to have that difference because um, you're going to be like going out with friends or doing whatever. Not that there's anything necessarily wrong with that because the age is still close enough. Um, but it's just like a more of like a life activity thing. Out of college while he's in the middle of it. Mm. Yeah, he's just going to be DD. I'm, you know what? I'm enjoying every moment of this. Nice How to meet are you? you? Again. Oh, yeah, I um, bet you are. Good, good, good. Are you nervous at all? Extremely. Me too. I'm um, a little bit nervous. Yeah, Sorry, what are you majoring in? Kinesiology. Uh, like yeah. PT? Yeah, yeah. I do community college, but I'm a business major right now. Yeah, business major. Are you marketing. planning on transfer somewhere? Like yes, business? not exactly sure where yet, but. Consider USC. Consider like, USC? Like, transfer? Like, You'll show me the spots. Yeah. <laughs> I go to UCLA, remember? We're rivals. Oh, I know it's really remember. Flag, but no. distance wouldn't be a problem for us. I'm gonna tell you a secret. UCLA was my dream school too. Oh really? I got waitlisted. I don't think I got. She off the is in love I... with him. She is so in love with him already. He just had to say black pink or whatever because she's like, it's you. You are it for me. Got into the rival school and like. No. Oh, that's just I like, I got rejected from USC, so... It's all arbitrary, like that... Yeah. The whole process. What would you say is like a green flag? A green flag? Okay, this is like a really specific green flag, but like if they can cook, like that's a plus. Oh, that, yeah. yeah, that's nice. <gasps> <laughs> it's okay, it's okay, you don't need to know how to cook. I can make like very basic things. Okay. Like a salmon bowl, I got you. Ooh! I don't mind if they don't know how to cook, but it would be like to what extent, like... Can I give you one very simple task and you don't, you could mess that up or like whatever, you know what I mean? Like, oh, can you just like cut this and they completely butcher it? And I'm like, hmm, we have a problem here. It's like, uh, like if they don't know and they Google like how people cut something or if they Google or if they just like, um, do an okay job of it, just based off what they would guess how you would do it. That's totally fine. Other than that, I think the most complicated thing I've ever done was like cereal. <laughs> what are your? Yeah, hobbies? I feel like you should cook. Um, I like know how to cook fiber, some so basics. Outside. Huh. <laughs> are you afraid of heights? I'm not afraid of heights, mm -hmm. but I just feel like I wouldn't be athletic enough to like. Oh no! It's climb a it's just wall. fun. It'd be cute if the girl teach me taught you how to cook. Yeah, I think that's fine as long as like they're willing they're down to like learn or it's like interesting to them too. Yeah. I was about to say I really like your outfit. Oh, Those thank boots are you. awesome. Thank you. I was scared to wear them because I didn't know how tall you were. Kind of a power move. Where'd you get the skirt? The skirt is from Depop. Shop second hand. Oh, I'm super into fashion. I saw <laughs> you a little there. You still have to name it. <laughs> what do you, you have any ideas? Honestly I feel like Melvin Jr. was a good one. Okay. <laughs> 
style is fun. Cute. Like you can tell a lot about a person looking at their outfit. What would you like say about me? Okay, the black is giving like a little bit reserved, mysterious, but then the teddy bear is like, okay, well he has a soft spot. <laughs> There's two sides to everybody. I like her. I think that this interaction seems pretty good. You know, it seems like a like a nice yeah they're vibing like back and forth you know you know what i've been She's trying winning. to do recently? <laughs> i want a racing jacket really bad yeah, but i, I haven't those. been able to like find one we got a thrift same bro we'll find one gotcha. we'll find one so are do you, you like... into fashion or anything like that not really are you no, i swear whatever looks like <laughs> that sounded like a are you into fashion she's like no not really he's like oh like yeah neither <laughs> I prefer vibing to just flirting. Yeah, I agree. I think it's nice when it seems like you guys can get along as friends. Um, I think flirting back and forth is... It kind of makes it... You can gauge how witty the person is if they're able to flirt back and forth with you. But at the same time, I just feel like the... If you're... If you feel like you have more shared common... like ground or things in common or you're like vibing as friends and that feels a lot more genuine and like you have like a real like basis off of like a friendship or something to like take off actually <laughs> yeah. i have one question it's not just like attraction or initial like um how good they are with the opposite sex or like the same sex whatever it is like the, it's like whoever it it's not like um how do i describe it just how well they're able, like, their riz or how well they're able to, like, flirt. Is this, like, a person overall type of thing? Ben, Tarantino, or Nolan? Okay. Nolan. Really? I'm not gonna lie. Really? Like, okay, I, I, I do find Tarantino movies, like, really entertaining. Yeah, yeah. I just enjoy Nolan. Okay, movies okay. More. Favorite Nolan movie? This is, this might be a hot take. I should have said this earlier. But I really enjoyed Tenet. <gasps> like, no, I no, really no, really? Tenet. Oh, my God. God, I love Tenet. Growing up, I liked a lot of anime. Are you like, are you still into anime? Or? I honestly don't have time, but I read a lot of manga, and I'm watching Spy Family right now. We should watch one together. Spy Family. <laughs> yeah. Um, I wanted to ask, like, what's your nationality? I'm Chinese. Oh, okay, yeah. cool, cool. Chinese, but um, I was born like here in LA. Mm -hmm. My mom's from China, and like my dad kind of grew up in Hong Kong. Kong. So, nice. Yes. I'm Bosnian, but I grew up here. Yeah, it's just both of my parents are from there. I really like it there. I actually lived there for like a year. Oh wow, yeah. how'd you like that experience? It was so good. I feel like it's always nice to like um, meet people that are the same like you and just like really get in touch with your culture. Do you know exactly what you're like looking for? Like long term, short term, just for fun? Honestly, I'm still trying to figure that out to be same, honest. Same. Um, I've only like been on this earth for 19 years, so there's a lot for me very to like true, figure very out. True. Mm -hmm. Are you involved in anything on campus? Yeah, so I'm um, a campus ambassador and then I'm also on a dance team. You're gonna like bust out a move right oh now? Oh my gosh, no. So it would be like, crazy yeah. if you did. I can be like, I think, I think she should. Wait, I'll teach you the wave. If you do, if you do, I'll jerk. Yeah, he looks young. <laughs> Wait, okay, I'll jerk and then you jerk. Fine, <laughs> I'll take that. Well, I'll take I don't that. Know what else to show you? That's pretty good. That's pretty good. That was good. Okay, Is it my turn? Is it my turn? Hey, 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 hey. Wait, that was really good. <laughs> Thank you. Yeah, so we could dance together a lot. Oh, okay, uh, rapid fire. Uh, la, la, la. Uh, so, the weather. Yeah, it's it's okay. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> you said your parents were Chinese, right? Yeah. My parents too. Are you Kanto or? Kanto. Yeah, Kanto, oh, let's leho, go. Leho. Yeah. <laughs> it was nice meeting you. Thank you. Oh, good meeting you. The last couple of interactions just felt okay. Okay, I, I have an opinion. I think you. Oh, really? Yeah. Me? <laughs> it's between Regina yeah. and um, I'm so sorry. Yeah. Brianna, <laughs> yes. It's between like out of you two. Yeah. Oh. I feel like you guys got along really well. Yeah. That Your little conversation was so cute. <laughs> this is good, good. I'm glad to hear that. I think it's between, yeah, the same people. Well, like, I really like her. I hope of her with him, you know? They vote.
Wow. Our ladies have selected someone for you. Okay. Yep. Are you ready? I'm, I'm ready. Do I'm you ready. trust these women? I do, I do. Are you sure? With my life. One, two, three. Hi. <laughs> Hi. Oh this my is God. the least fave. No. Mm. Did you, were you expecting that or was it? Close call. I was, was kind of hoping for it. You were. Yeah, oh, oh, that he knows how to say it. <laughs> really good. Okay, so after the first round, I had Estelle, Regine, and Brianna. Uh huh. Oh, so he also picked. Guys, look, it's kind of crazy, huh? Yeah. <laughs> oh no way! <laughs> what are the odds? That would have been awkward. We can go thrifting now. We can. And you got to get me into USC. Wow. Thanks. Can you settle on a name for the bear? You get to name it since you won. Brianna. <laughs> I'll go with that. Uh, that's a good name. All right, do we think we're going to do like a number exchange? Definitely. Yeah, we're going thrifting. Okay. There you go. Right, okay, guys. now we check back. <laughs> Are they dating now or what? <laughs> I feel great. I hope she feels great. I feel awesome. Yes. <laughs> Pause. Oh, I mean, that was okay. That just, I mean, um, it's just hard to say because, I mean, it's just like a... Let's see. Are they dating? Or maybe not IG official. There's so many things now. Did you guys hear about like the terms of like launching someone? <laughs> launching someone. Um, okay, I don't know it doesn't show. Whatever. Uh, like a uh, hard hard launching, soft launching. Yes, apparently there's that on Instagram now, where like you have a um, if you just show them. Uh, that you're eating across the table from like uh somebody and they have their arm there and something or whatever it is that's like the soft launch yeah and then if you uh tag them or if you start having like take photos with them and posting them it's like hard launching them <sighs> the modern day uh invented terminology for shit like this is social media Super Nintendo. Did it open? It was it like, like a, um, a rectangle. It was the box one, and you like put the game in it. I think she's. I think she's. she's, 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 she's <laughs> yeah, you know, you go there. Okay. How old are you guys? Just okay. kidding. Okay. <laughs> Just kidding. What was the first movie? I'm too boomer. In explain it to me again. Um, it's just like stages to. kind of tell your social media that you're seeing someone or dating yeah i genuinely can't remember the first harry potter spider-man 3. spider-man for me as well yeah spider-man 3. Two. Oh. beauty and the beast the animated one the animated one wait is this like favorite movie <laughs> what or the first movie they remember watching okay how old are you guys just okay. kidding okay <laughs> just kidding what was the first movie you guys saw in oh, the saw in theaters Mine was, I remember, it was Princess Diaries, the first one. And then my second movie that I ever watched in theaters was Cat Dog. I genuinely can't remember it. The first Harry Potter. Spider-Man 3. Spider-Man for me as well. Wait, the first Harry Potter? Mm. I genuinely can't remember it. The first Harry Potter. Spider-Man 3. Spider-Man for me as well. Yeah. Lilo and three? Stitch. Oh. Beauty and the Beast. The animated one? The animated one. Let's bring him over here. Yeah, that guy, that guy, that guy. I don't, I don't even remember watching Be Beauty and the Beast was in theaters. I remember it on VHS and like those giant disc things. <laughs> Maybe Toy Story. The first one? I think so, yeah. Was that also? I definitely saw that on like VHS or some other thing. I think mm -hmm. you should yeah. come this way. Yep, I think so too. <laughs> do any of you guys play video games? I do. Yes. I just beat Pokemon. Which one? A shining Pearl. I have an Xbox. I also play League of Legends. The oh. last video game I played is probably League of Legends. Pokemon. I think you're older. Could you play some of the games that like 
my older brother and his friends play. Oh, <laughs> okay. Behind or in front of me? I think she might be older than you. I could see it. All right. I don't, is this that Nintendo. old? Nintendo. First Nintendo or the Super Nintendo? That's as far as I know. I don't even know what you're saying right now. <laughs> Did it open? Was it was it like, like a, um, a it was the box one and you like put the game in it. I think she's, I think she's, 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 she's <laughs> She sounds boomer, but I can't tell if she's just so zoomer that she doesn't know. But at the same time, it's like. Let's do for work. I'm a lash artist and I write music. Same, I'm music, that's okay. what I do. I'm at a mall and I sell uh, glass cleaner. I'm like, hey boss, let me see your glasses. Yeah, yeah. Gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. How's it going? Oh, awesome. I'm an actor. Content creator. Today was the most embarrassing day of my life. <laughs> I review. Is that him? For a living, semi-retired. Yeah. And just go to people's. Wait, what, he, uh, he cleans pools, he I said? Review a review pools. pools. For a living, semi-retired. Yeah. And just go to people's pools. Where do you review them? Yeah. Like, do you post it on? Laser like, disc. Yeah. Cool. Just like on my Instagram. Yes, That's laser cool. disc. Yeah. I think I'm older than you, though. I'm going off for body language mm. and then how you talked about your job. You know, I'm a youthful individual. I will say that. <laughs> Take, it. Take it. Has anyone ever faced any discrimination based on their age? Oh. Yes. All the that time. <laughs> Let me tell you, like corporate world, like oh, as a woman or business, like I've had my own businesses and, you know, I'm talking to a guy and he's just like, oh, like, didn't you just get out of high school? Like, is this your dad's company? Uh, yeah. You know, mm -hmm. and I'm just like, yeah. no, sir. Like I started it myself, <laughs> like, you know. I think a lot of women have to carry themselves in a different energy than they do regularly. You have to be more dominating. You have to present yourself as more capable than I think the average guy does. Like you have things to prove, I feel like. I get the kid a lot. So people are like, oh, kid, it's your first job, kid, or like, that's whatever. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So when I used to work retail and I wanted to get promoted, they were like, oh, no, you're just young and you just. I don't know. I don't recall anything. I'm sure it's happened, but I do not recall anything negatively, I guess. If anything, it's been more positive than negative because I feel like people are nicer to me sometimes because they feel like I'm more of a kid or younger. So they're more like, Okay, like just get this, like blah, blah blah. They like step, like do more step by step versus being kind of more like, hey, yeah, do this. Um, um, yeah, I feel like usually people almost treat me nicer. Unless it's in the environment maybe of like, thinking we're making trouble or something but otherwise no you know like sometimes i would negotiate for a certain price point over email i'm making my voice sound very assertive over the phone and then they would see me and immediately they would be like oh we're paying this young kid too much money for this so i went through a phase where i grew out my facial hair i wow. stopped styling my hair as much because i was like okay i let it get to me too much i think it's really hard to date people i remember like my first boyfriend i had when he showed my picture to his friends they're like why are you dating a fifth grader even though we were the same age the specific people who decide to send me dms on like instagram that's so or sad Facebook, and you can just kind of tell there's this weird like you're not just saying hi for the sake of getting to know me like this it feels very um ins like a little bit insidious i feel like for me I always get the shock of just, uh, no way, like, you're not, like, 32 or whatever it is versus anything else. It's not, like, uh, like, when they ask people, like, guess how old I am, or they find out how old I am, then they're like, no way, and then that's, like, I don't think that's judgment or anything really that, but, like, I say sometimes it doesn't feel good that I'm that much older, but it It's not like good. I don't know. I think I stopped caring as much, even though it's like a little. It's it's like oh no, no way! You're like twenty four, twenty five, and I'm like, yeah, I wish, I wish. It's like a, it's more like a. <laughs> I wish I was versus like other things. I guess. I think you two should switch. Two. These two are well. switching, I'm and then, switching with and him, then I'm I going. Think? I'm gonna. I'm put myself here. I would maybe switch right here. Dax is a little chill. He's a I little. I feel like he's gonna he's throw us all off. 
is yeah. the thing. Yeah. Mm. I have a question to me help. How would you guys describe your fashion? Beach you with an edge, something like that? Really specific to what you're saying. Beach you with an edge. Easier because I prefer comfort over everything. Just hip enough, but also like just <laughs> like comfortable enough. That's giving me millennial. Okay, that's mm -hmm. yeah. Yeah. What is like your favorite thing to do to relax or decompress? Just make a lot of videos. When you say videos, is that like Twitch or YouTube? YouTube and TikTok, yeah. YouTube and TikTok. Mm -hmm. yeah, see, mm -hmm. I think he's younger. I just got into TikTok. Dax was the hardest one to figure out. Dax yeah, that is hard. Dax me like a little bit older energy, but then like some of the, stuff, the stuff that he was yeah. seeing was more with like the younger stuff. I think a lot of people often tell me that I look younger than I am. Well, sometimes they tell me, like they used to tell me I looked older. These days they've been telling me I look younger. I think also she may surprise us too. Yeah, I think so too. Because yeah, she's possibly. mature. She's mature, but I think you're mature because you like had to be to like get the respect, like when you shared your story. But oh, I that's think... deep. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that okay. is deep. I think I'm right, right after him, and I think she's right next to me. You're here, and then okay. I think there. This? Yeah. No, I don't. I don't know. Oh, yeah, I, don't know I would switch with you. And then you I think what? you two should switch too. So I'm here. Yeah. And then, yeah. I, okay. You we'll think? See. We'll see. Because hmm. I feel like there's a very calm demeanor about mm -hmm. Dax. Oh, it's the standing with the hands <laughs> behind the back for me. Yeah. Right between Dax yeah. and Kaya. Right here. I'll go right okay. here. Oh. Yeah, right there. Oh. Yeah. Oh. Why are you still in the front spot? I'm pretty confident we have that not I'm in the right spot. Dude, he watched the movie of like Beauty and the Beast in theaters or some shit. Like, like Beauty and the Beast in theaters? He has to be older. There's no shot. Like the rest of you be watching Spider-Man 3 or 2 for the first time in theaters? Of course he's at the front. Okay. Pool okay. reviews? Yeah. Oh yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> Okay, I think this, yeah. I feel like there is gonna definitely okay. be a surprise. Mm -hmm. Where I would I be don't. here is, I'm gonna take a guess. But I'm like, somewhere here, like middle. Um, either before or after this girl, maybe. All right. Maybe, fuck. Maybe before this girl. Like right here? Yeah, I could look, but the thing is like I, I Asian jeans and um I, I just think I maybe before this girl. Maybe even before this guy. This range. No who it's gonna be mm, at this point. Was anyone trying to be tricky at any point? No. No, I'm trying to get this right. <laughs> yeah. In our youngest spot, we have Ignacio at 25. Oh, okay. okay. In our second spot, we have Jackie at 26. Okay. okay. All right. Okay. Okay. Pretty good. Yeah, that's pretty good. Okay. So far, so good. In our third spot, we have Dax at 30. Oh. Uh -huh. In our fourth spot, we have Kaya at 32. Okay, yeah, I was right. It was like one of these, but... Uh, I was after this girl. Yeah. Okay. And our fifth spot, we have Victor at 34. Mm-hmm. All right. And in our sixth spot, we have Jeff at 40. You're 40? Dude, I thought I was thinking 37. I was like 30. <laughs> he just has fucking Asian jeans because he... This guy does not look 40, bro. He looks 30. What do you mean at the end? I'm in the middle. 37, 38, I was like, he's like, 37, 38, he's like, okay. late 30s. Yeah. They, they got it pretty accurate. It's just these two that are switched. Wow. They did a good job. I was surprised with Victor, purely off of just aesthetic and just his look. Also because he has really good skin. I only knew he was the youngest from his, like, his aesthetic and how he talked about his style and everything. It reminded me so much of my younger <laughs> brother around your age. I thought you were older than me, but like you were just with it, like with mm -hmm. the times. Body language was also a lot more mature, mm -hmm. which was why I placed you a lot higher. So I feel really bad about this comment. <laughs> <laughs> I feel like there is a focus on things that you lose as you age. Physical ability, for example, is like I can no longer run as fast or have as much stamina and there's less of a focus on what you gain as you get older. Does everyone get told that they look 
younger than they are? Yes. Yeah, so mm -hmm. I also work as a substitute teacher, and so when I'm in a classroom, I feel like I have to like overcompensate with like, mm -hmm. I'm in charge, don't mess with me, because <laughs> I just find that a lot of the default that people have is like, oh yeah, she's young, I can just do whatever. Yep. Yeah. yeah. Like more yeah. chill. Mm -hmm. You the gain wrinkles. Is a huge factor yeah. In a professional field, in the dating world, or just like in public, and people judge people like how how they choose to respect them. Don't ever let the way people view you affect your dreams and what you want to do. They said, hey, you know, your, your energy is very, very youthful, you know. Were you cool with that? Um, but I think it, in my head, I was like, oh, wow. I think if I did this, like the things that I would say that I've experienced would show my age in terms of if I was like, oh, yeah, like VHS or like whatever that type of stuff. But energy wise, I think it might throw people off because I feel like I have younger like slightly more crackhead energy at times so yeah they probably put me somewhere in the middle Do, 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 do. Sorry, I'm just like looking for the next video per slaps. Okay. Uh... <laughs> this sounds kind of funny. Okay. A couple yogurt with cereal. Yeah, no, they have a uh, yogurt that has cereal bits in them. That's hella good. It just doesn't taste healthy at that point, though. Internet Explorer. Yeah, exactly. I think this, the things that I say I know of will show my age. But the energy and maybe the look will be younger. They're, they're going to be confused. Walk like the cops do it. Heal the toe. Show us. I'm going to start it off. Okay, go ahead. Who's the most drunk? <laughs> Arrested. No. Hmm. No chaser. No chaser. Oh God. Why don't we start by just doing a quick introduction? This is Kennedy. She is from Los Angeles and she is 25. This is Bryce. He's from New Jersey and he's also 25. I'm Roman. He looks drunk already, bro. And I'm hey, put him. 22, 23, and I'm from Glendale. I'm great. Okay, rank these two more at the end. Bryce, I'm 22 and I'm from Baltimore, Maryland. She seems kind of oh, sober. 41 and from the Bay Area. My name is Gabe, I'm 22, and I'm from Massachusetts. I'm Kat, I'm 24. I'm allergic to Olali berries. I don't want people to know where I live. You don't want me? <laughs> you don't need to give me a dress. <laughs> <laughs> What's the zip code? What do you guys think you're going to be looking for? Speech, yeah. for sure. Speech, yeah. I, I... At the end on this time, everyone has told me, and people continue to tell me, that when I'm drunk, they can't tell. Uh, they can't tell because they say I'm the same. I'm the exact same. Like, I just talk similarly, like, whatever it is. I think I am also similar because I just have this sense of, like, I still know what I'm doing and I have a uh, responsibility in my head. Like, I will check on my phone throughout the night. I no, trust me, I have been, like, drunk, drunk, and people don't even know 
my friend told me the other day actually he said that he didn't know how drunk i was because talking to me it seemed fine and next thing you know i was in the bathroom throwing up like so i was drunk to that extent and he still didn't could not tell that i was that fucked up I guess I was looking at people's like skin tone, whether they were getting flushed or not. I'm if just still able to be composed, I like guess. Loud. Can you walk straight? Can you talk? But I did well? say like, I right. wish I could be more of a fun, expressive drunk where I, you could tell that I'm drunk. You know, I like say things differently or I'm more like expressive or whatever, but I'm, I'm just kind of not. I'm just the same. I just feel it all. And I've never blacked out before. Grace, would you like to demonstrate? I remember yeah, most yeah. things. There might be parts of the night that I don't remember exactly, but for the most part, in the moment, I'll still vaguely know what I'm doing. Um, it's just a matter of like, sometimes when you're drunk, you just care less, right? Or you're more like, whatever about stuff. I don't become bubbly. I might laugh at things a little bit more, but yeah, that's it. I have major Asian glow too. We gotta walk like the cops do it. Oh. Heal the toe, show us. I'm gonna start it off. Okay, go ahead. <laughs> wow. Bro, put this okay. guy at the end, man. He's most drunk. Are we all walking? Watch this. Put him there. I've trained my whole life for this. You got right. this. I so believe heel, in you. Toe, heel, toe. I'll you give a bit it. of space Ooh. so it looks natural. Oh, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> okay. okay, Roman, all right. You did it. Show us what you got. Show us what you got. He's great. Well, am I supposed to like do the. All right, let's go. Let's get him out. Let's get him out. drunk. <laughs> all right, Roman. This guy also. I, I He's know. number two. That's not heel, toe. <laughs> Flawless. Look, I'm, I'm gonna just say those two already need to be over here. Yes. You think Kennedy needs no, to be no, over no, there? No, okay, no, interesting, no, interesting. No, interesting. No, okay. 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 You're not the most drunk because you're the most confident. That's not how that works. Right? <laughs> we need to put him okay. in the middle and we'll adjust from there. It'll make it easier. Ooh, okay. I like, do you see what I mean? Like being a drunk like this could be fun. As long as I'm not obnoxious or like cause, making trouble for other people. Like I think it'd be fun to be like a fun drunk versus just the same. Okay, He's not that drunk. He's not that drunk. Right in the middle. So let's work down the line. Okay, let's work yeah. down the cat. How you feeling? How you feeling? You guys I think, think like Danny is fucking hilarious. How is this compared to I like a Cass night out? Number two. This, this would be like. Danny's one of my favorite there. people so to hang yeah, out with when he's drunk. I'm at the wait, wait, Bryce, right are you? Or when they're drunk. drunk. More. That's a tough question. It's no, an experience. You think you're more? No, he's more. I feel like we should start lining top to bottom first. Let's meet. Okay. Let, let's get both ends. I never been drunk, but I imagine I'm a we crier. Ooh, out. I had I had a friend do that. I had a friend get drunk and then he was a crier. Okay. I'm gonna go I'm with you. Seat. I'm gonna okay. go with you. We're gonna go here? this way. I think you should go in the middle. I think you should go in the middle. Okay, let's go this way. They didn't go over there. I Roman, Roman's chill. I think, no, I think I'm Roman the is least the most drunk. Do you see yourselves? Like, he's not the least drunk. He's not the least drunk. I think Oki is the least drunk. Just go to the end, accept your fate. Okay. Roman? Yes? I feel like you are you deserve a higher spot of You gotta be at least second most. Yeah. Literally no way. No, 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 no. Second or third at most. I think you'd be in the middle. To be completely Roman? I, I think I could still talk, but sometimes I might fuck up my words. Like at most, if I am really drunk, I might say things, and it's like it's like I fuck up my phrasing or the words that I use. I, um, and that's those are times you can maybe tell. But I do that sometimes normally too already, but more when I'm drunk. It's on you. Yeah. Right now, I'm up in here. So let's do But this. I'm like, bruh. <laughs> I don't, I feel like I would. Bro, I would go to the, the most. Mm, mm. Maybe like I, here. I fully agree with you. Yes. Me. Well, okay, hold up. I have the, I have the answers. I have the answers. <laughs> so how often do you drink? Never. Okay, he never drinks. How often do you drink? Five times a week. My girlfriend's a bartender. Okay. See? Wow. See? Two times a week, probably. He drinks two times a week. Wow. Five times a week. That's insane. Yeah, Once a week. Ten. Yeah, we do that every day. Every day, every day. Okay. Four to five times a week. Okay. I drink wow. maybe once a 
fucking but month. But I think, I think that checks out. Exactly, your tolerance, right yeah. Now. BAC, is BAC based on like your height and weight? Okay. It's based on your, your weight and your gender. It's on my refrigerator, okay, so I okay, know how many okay. drinks I can have. There's no way this guy's more sober than I am. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. I love you, but no. I'm sorry. I love you too, but you're incorrect. <laughs> I love you too, but I just met you. <laughs> move him, bro, move, move him. Yeah, no. you guys switch. You are misunderstanding. Who has video footage of Yvonne drunk? I mean, There's been times where I've logged it, but it was just for a split second. I'm kind of like, I'm a little buzzed. Or I'm a little drunk, but it's like very little, you know? Wow. That's I am there's not like a... Did you guys get that? Did you get that? I'm not American, wow. so it only makes sense for me to mess up. It's not because at I'm least drunk. We should switch. I'm not the least drunk, but I know I'm less than you, for at least. It's a group decision. You'll be proven right if you're right. You'll be proven right. They said right. you're over there. Well, the time is up. We need to figure said. this out. Yeah. Yeah. We're in the drunk among us? No. Absolutely no way. No <laughs> way. No way. Bite me. Yeah, that's interesting. She has a blood alcohol chart on her fridge. <laughs> Breathalyzer. You ready? Yeah, let's do it. Does that determine how drunk you are, though? Point one one. I told you! I mean, I knew that he was high. He should, <laughs> wait, he should be dead. That's not how that works. Okay, okay. That's not how that works. Do we move? It's very high. Oh. One oh zero. Uh, I mean, one oh zero. exactly the same. Point one one seven. Woo! Wait, isn't it just how much? It's gonna be so low. It's gonna be Zero. so low. I oh! What is it? 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 I have five point one two. Yeah! That's one. Are we correct so far? You stay up there. Okay, you go, girl. Yeah. It's a long countdown. Wait, wait, no, 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 no. Wait till it hits zero. Now you drunk. I don't know which yeah. one of you guys works on editing, but y'all gonna have a field day with this one. What was yours? Point one two. God damn it! I mean, gosh darn it! Oh! We're the exact same. We are. No, so wow. Point one two zero. Okay, here we go. Point one one two. Wow. This is what everybody's been waiting for. <laughs> I just want to say, I bet you oh, I'm not blow, most right. drunk. Just Fair enough. Blow. Did I get it? Yeah, we're just waiting now. I bet. Woo! One point, one, point one four nine. Yeah. Point one four nine. So Bryce is the youngest. Yeah. We got the same exact but, amount. But I, if you have like the same amount of alcohol in your blood, doesn't that also vary? Like, this also depend on how drunk you like you are. Like, someone could have more alcohol content in themselves, but what if they just don't get drunk that easily? Is that how it works? You know what I mean? It's probably more like who drank the most alcohol. That's what I mean. It, it just feels like it's like, oh, it doesn't mean you're the most drunk, though, just because you drank the most. Okay, you the, you're the least. I know. I, I told y'all you won't. Um, you're, you know yourself. You nailed you are it. A, you are a very the confident, and secure person. What can I say? I mean, uh... they pretty much is really close. The manager behavior better based on tolerance. Yeah, I feel like sometimes I am super fucked up, but I can handle. Things still okay compared to other people maybe having the same. I'm amount? honestly confused. Thanks, I took five shots of tequila before this within an hour, so good for me, I guess. This man took ten. That's yeah. a fuckload. <laughs> Goes without saying, Bryce is not a, an experienced alcohol consumer. Oh, I always knew Bryce was the drunkest. He like had that no inhibition sort of thing going. So you want to give me your thoughts? 
thoughts. I did not think I was the most drunk, but that's <laughs> what I was, and that's okay. <laughs> I want to be like that, but I'm not. Sad. I'll be honest, I don't know if you're a one spot. Mainly, no, and the, the only reason why is because the first photo of you looks nothing like you do now. That is true. This will probably be my last video that I'm watching and I'll to play one game after this I'm done. Then I gotta go. I go with Tinder and Bumble, but Tinder I feel like I get a lot more attention on. For me, Bumble is... So the title of this is Ranking Men by Their Dating Profiles. Mostly the quality uh, maybe like Valorant? This is me, you know. I like the first picture. Uh, you should leave a comment if you work on being a better person for yourself, your friends, family, society, all while being your quirky, goofy self. I like that. This is me reading mm -hmm. to my brother's dog. Smart to put a dog. <laughs> Very smart. Smart to put Very a dog. <laughs> you know, putting pets in a dating profile usually is like, oh, you're like, you like animals. So, you know, candid. You're verified. Got the verified check. We got the vaccinated sticker. Gotta be vaccinated. Vaccinated oh, sticker? Wow. Gotta rock, the gotta rock the dark saber. So gotta rock the dark saber. And the bio is, I just- Wait, what's the dark saber? Oh. oh gotta wow. rock, gotta okay, rock the dark Disneyland. saber. Disneyland. Gotta rock the dark saber. And the bio is, I just moved to Long Beach. I need someone to show me around. Um, I'm honestly just a big nerd. And look, I have no reason to be on here. So let's skip the small talk and just go on a date. I feel like Nick and Rick are like established people who know who they are, and I feel like when it comes to dating, that's a necessity. All right. My profile tomorrow. Valor. Tattoo friend is. Yeah, this is a great first picture. Sorry. Thank yeah. you. Yeah. Do your chin, yeah. Oh my God. <laughs> oh. Gentleman by day, philosopher by night, lover by choice, rebel by fate. Oh. Currently. <laughs> oh, it's true. Some poetry. Currently apprenticing at a tattoo yeah, they're shop. Like, I spend all my free time finding scenic views on. Um. Okay, sorry. Uh, my thoughts. I I feel like I don't care about this personally. Um. Although it is different than a lot of dating profiles, maybe like like than saying like, "Hey, I am I uh currently moved to I don't know I'm I'm like describing I don't fucking but." I mean, at least it gives specific as to what they like. Motorcycle, draws, museum, reading, shows. So it's. I guess it's uh, good that there's there are, uh, so interests or things that people um, can gauge. Like if you like museums or if you do, if you're into art, then yeah. I'll eat all the food. I hey, with extreme risk. <laughs> Pro, I'll cook for you. Con, I'll eat all the food I cooked for you. <laughs> I like this picture. Okay. I don't think this con is a very good uh, follow-up to that, but I like this picture. Funny. <laughs> I'm this. this is my profile. It's on Hinge. Um, I first begun with like a prompt. Tobey Maguire's the best Spider-Man. Hey, not gonna lie, I see this prompt and I just think like, okay, and <laughs> I just think, so what? <laughs> uh, I don't know. Just don't Tony care. Maguire's the best Spider Man. I just don't think it's like a topic that people would be like, oh yeah, I really care about this topic. Let's debate it. And then I'm a software engineer. And this is just a picture I I put like after graduation. Me and my friend were That's fine. Uh, drinking champagne in front of our school library. And then this is just a picture of like me and this dog. This dog is cute. Blue. This could be us. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. That's a good this could be us Being picture. Like uh, drinking champagne. Uh, in what's this bottom one this say? Just... Uh, okay, I can't, can't read it. It just says skip sh opening sequence of TV shows, but I can't read like whatever. It's a picture of like me and this dog found in Peru. This could be us. <laughs> <laughs> no, no way he's six feet. They say he's six picture. feet. Yeah. Wait, what? Yeah, I mean, it, it's. Wait. 
it, it's in it's in reverse, but like it's the same. It's like ace to a queen, but right. Mm -hmm. So it's Tyler. I got a modeling picture, right? You know, uh, lactose intolerant, but willing to indulge dairy with the right person. Oh, that's kind of that's fine. I feel yeah. like I'm six one. Okay. All right. Swipe right if you want, and then it's got the little you know ticky tock. Oh God. <sighs> I don't know why I just don't like when people put their Instagram. Okay, I understand you put their Instagram to look at more pictures. I kind of just don't like them putting Instagrams on their profiles because I feel like you're just trying to get followers or like whatever on that. And also the guy's name, Asians Boy Swaga, does not seem like a great username to make. All that. I would just look at that username and be like, Bro, I don't want to. I don't want to go to that page. His username. What the fuck is that? Thing where it's like, mm -hmm. okay, if we think about it logically, these two are software engineers. It's if a you, red flag. <laughs> yeah. You are just looking for someone to take you on a date who can afford to take you on a nice date. It's a software engineer. Yeah. I don't know about that because I think it's more like you know they're looking for someone they can see themselves with, and you know I think like. Occupation it can be important, but it's like I, I feel like you know you guys have a ton of fun pictures where it's like, man, I want to be friends with you. Let's go. Let's hang out after this. I'll, you know what? I'm I'm kind of I, I feel like I'm pretty locked into that number two spot. I feel like number I just, two spot. Why? I'm right there. Yeah. You think I so? feel like I, I bio's got everything. Girls like taking photos. I I'm very photogenic. And... I'm sorry. I need to see this again. What was his profile? This, this guy. To indulge dairy with the right person. Mm. Mm -hmm. what, yeah. I don't, what does this mean? Need a ride right. or die partner? Okay, sorry, I'm gonna move this. What does it mean? That need a ride or die partner, D-Y-E? Like gambling or like, what do you say? What does this mean? I, w I also wish I had the confidence of some of these people in these videos. Swipe right if you want. Swipe right if you want. Ooh, like, that's not anything crazy or, or like, you know. I'm sorry. This guy thinks he should be at the end for what? Your Instagram is Asian boy swagger, bro. That's like a... <laughs> like, I would just... Want, and then Never. He's got, little, you know, he's got the confidence of like, Sam. Okay, if we think about it. Yeah, yeah, the More gardener. Like, you know, but it's Bro, it's like, a grocery clerk. Wait, did it say over. that? You're right, you know. Uh, little, you know, ticky talky thing. Wait, and yeah. Like, Who are you? Yeah, I think you guys have a ton of fun. I, I hate this already. I just. With the confidence of a CEO. <laughs> My guy is a grocery clerk with the confidence of a CEO. You're not wrong, bro. You're not wrong. Oh, I'm, I'm kind of, I, I feel like I'm pretty locked into that number. Okay, two. like, why are they talking about, no, no, no. They're, were they talking about how software engineers should be further at the front? I feel like some girls agree, like, would agree with that. Or some people would agree with that. Like, some people would just... Uh, feel like software engineer, you make a decent amount of money that's like secure, or whatever. Some people would be down for that. So, be in like five years to right be the there, manager. Yeah. It's true because I'm pretty sure more people, if anything, would just see grocery clerk and they'll be like, uh, no, swipe. You think I so? feel like I, or I, like, I like, or like X, I mean. Photos. I, I'm very photogenic. And... I'm gonna be honest. You've got the smarts and you've got the adventure aspect. You've got the artist style, the motorcycle, all that. I will happily take the fifth position because my bio sucks. You gotta, you ain't gotta do that to yourself. What was his bio again? He said his bio sucks. This guy? Great photo. Oh, wow. Oh, gotta rock, wow. gotta rock the dark saber. So okay. got Digital media specialist. Um, gotta rock the dark saber. And the bio is... A just moved to Long Beach, need someone to show me around. I'm honestly just a big nerd. This, his bio is not that bad. It's just like a normal, like whatever. And he has this, what? Hey, no, hey, put that guy at the end. Don't take the fifth spot, move, move. His bio is completely fine, bro. I, feel it was, like I, I thought right it was one of the better ones. Like I, I, 
I thought it was one of the best. Yes, because he has him at Disneyland. He likes Star Wars Disneyland. That's totally fine. A lot of people like nerdy things. Nothing wrong with being a nerd. Um, it's it's like he he had photos or like small things of interest, and it's just yeah. They're, and they're, it's not like a terrible picture. It was like a cool picture of him. With, was it was he in front of the Millennium Falcon or what was that? It's you know what the heck. Yeah, it, that to me that felt more genuine. There, yeah. you think I so? feel like I, I, I bios got everything. Girls like taking photos. I, Fuck I'm, you, bitch. Motorcycle. That's yourself, bro. Hey, if there you want to move it, that's on you. Bro. I just thought the rest of the group brought a little bit more no. than just the star. No, star don't love. say that. Don't say that. Loving Star Wars is valid. Liking something and having some interest is valid. It's just a matter of how you express or how extreme it is but it is valid yeah having interest is totally fine i'm a nerd okay. i'm gonna put myself here i'll put my oh, oh, no, you no, i i have short-term memory i literally already forgot these people's profiles this is me uh okay no. i like the first picture no. you should You're doing a better uh that's that's a nice like little thing that's fine um okay he has a picture oops the doggy baby Braddy, thanks so much for the sub candid you're verified got the verified check we got the vaccine okay. yeah i thought that one was fine too there wasn't anything yikes about it it just seemed like it's like a normal profile i feel i just thought the rest of the group brought oh, dude. So, the group brought a little bit more than just the star wars i don't know what was okay this guy Ranks himself four. Who is this? The tattoo Look, artist, philosopher. Speaking. Gentleman by day, philosopher by night. Uh, okay, sorry, I need to read this again. I already forgot. Currently apprenticing at a tattoo shop. Spend all of your free time finding scenic views on your motorcycle, listening to music while you draw. Um. Okay, God, I don't know how to rank between these two because I feel like they're. Um. The ones that are fine are all kind of like the same. The only thing you would rank is off how bad it is, below, like underneath that. Or <laughs> now, <laughs> than just a Star Wars loving. <laughs> I don't think any of them are genuinely bad, but I need to re-see these other two. I, I, I wanted to put myself. I want. I wanted to put myself at four. Now I look like a dick. You know, I, okay, I'm sorry. Who? I put. I got. What was this again? And then I'm a soft. Oh yeah, I did not like that prompt. Engineer. And this is just a picture I I put like after graduation. Me and uh -huh. my friend were uh, drinking champagne in front of our school library. And then this is just a picture of like me and this dog found in Peru. This could be okay, us. Okay. The Honestly, the answers to me are, or like the prompts are hella boring. Right. <laughs> <laughs> cool part, coolest part of his thing was the magic trick. Um, no, he, it says he was six feet. I guess that filters out a lot of people when they put, oh, I want the person to be at least six feet. So that filtered a lot of people out, but, or he would make the cut. <laughs> but, um... I don't know. I just liked all the other, like, these three profiles more than these two. I would rank all of these above these two. I think the Star Wars person would probably be first for me. Because I thought it was, like, a solid, genuine showing interest, cool, whatever the heck. And then um, these two are somewhere the same. And then this guy last to indulge dairy with the right person. <laughs> okay. The only reason why is because the first photo of you looks nothing like you do. The, the only mainly different. Oh, be honest. Like, you know, in front of like other people putting my uh, I don't You want me to move it over to the no. <laughs> then just a star yeah. I wanted to put myself oh, I want I wanted to put myself that simply four. because of his Instagram name. Maybe I'll, it's also me watching it. I feel like he's kind of. Now, I, I mean, like you can't it. see that through a profile. You want but... me to move it over to the number one? Sure, I'll sure, you know, sure. I'll thank, take thank the number you, one you. spot. Thank if y'all don't really want it, I'll, I'll take you. it. You know, if you guys don't want it. No! You know, I don't really feel comfortable like putting myself, you know, too high in front of like other people just because I think, you know, everyone is different. I'll be honest, I don't. You're. 
<sighs> this pr his prompts were so boring. I don't know if you're a one spot. Mainly, no, and the, the only reason why is because the first photo of you looks nothing like you do now. That is true. You I, look I hate so many dating profiles. They're just literally like the same. Um, <laughs> I see this on TikTok sometimes. I saw this is one really good TikTok that compiled all of the most generic um, things that people put. Uh, one of them was like, I like beating the estimated time on google maps or something like that um and i thought that was hilarious they're like this is the one that's a um or something along the lines of like i'll delete this app when i meet you that's like also another super generic one nothing like that that's what photo. i bring to the table that's what i bring to the table i got so doing viewer dating pro reviews that'd be fun when he looks that i can but i would feel into bad i want to put mario i want to right, do it listen mario this is your phone right okay I think like like that. I feel like this is. Wait, did we ring? Did we ring? No, no. Uh, I feel like I feel like Maro is like super right, dateable. I mean, bro, why is the guy with the most like normal profile or like the the ones that that? Why is he last? Why is he last? Why is this guy first? Yo, get him out of here. Touch That's cool. Yeah, I like it. I was actually thinking you two should go first. Just because I feel like you guys are well established. Yes. I wish and yep. know who you are and not not saying that you guys don't, but Hey, tell him. Tell him grocery clerk guy should not be first. No, I don't think it's not even about what he likes or the nerd thing. I just think it was like good, like you had good a uh, picture of like what you like and like something where you go out. You're like at Disneyland or something, right? And then, um, uh, like, the profile was just normal. It wasn't too cringe. It wasn't, like, whatever. Um, the, like, what the fuck is that, you know? <laughs> yes, it just seemed authentic. I would not, I'm not saying, like, yeah, I would swipe on that guy. No, I'm saying that, like, him for profile for someone who is interested in his things or whatever is more, like... I don't know how to describe it. It just seemed genuine or it seemed like normal. I, like I would think they're like a normal person, not some self-absorbed weirdo. Yeah. Shiro, thank you so much for the 33 months. Welcome back. Happy Mother's Eve on. Happy Mother's Day. Thank you for the tier three, Shiro. Thank you. Um, The Star Wars profile showing people how he is so that they don't get surprised after, you know? Yeah, it's like, I don't know. Doesn't fit there. Damn. Yes. Damn. Yes. Good. Now move. Keep moving. Move the first person. Damn. That was a big move. The Just being kind of like unapologetically, point. like kind of like I like this, is good. Not what I wanted. But well, especially with Tyler. Yeah. Having a specific interest would would allow you to attract someone who has that specific interest as well, instead of the general like. I like to travel. I like food. Cool, dude. You and like every other person. <laughs> like, what the fuck? Like, you know what I mean? Yeah, I like food. I like travel. I like um, uh, trying new things here and there. Or like, you know, I like Netflix. Like a one night stand. Totally fine if you do, but I just think uh that having something specific would um, attract the type of person that would be compatible with you, which is what you're trying to... Um, oh, maybe, I guess maybe it depends on what your uh, intention is for the dating apps or whatever. I like free falling in battle rank. I like being bottom frag so I could feel something. Uh, Renzog, thank you so much for the two months. Welcome back. Thank you. Yes, thank God. Oh, thank God there's a girl here to judge. Good things, um, I would say Wait. occupation. We always no, get... like liking food, travel, totally fine. But I just think that if you are trying to like, it's, it's just honestly uh, something that everyone would probably say or put on there. That's what they do. 
Um, we look at their pictures, shirtless, you can, mirror, selfies, that's... Put, yeah, put that you're fluent in Twitch language. It's like saying you love to laugh. Yes, yes, thank you. It's like saying, yeah, I love... I uh, live, laugh, love or some shit. Like, oh, I... I would like someone fun or uh, someone nice. Uh, no, just, I like being alive. I like breathing air. Something I wouldn't swipe right on. Okay, let's see what they picked for most. Tyler. It's good. A lot of emojis. The last selfie is kind of like he's into himself. Yes, cringe. Okay, next one. He's verified. If we go out with any stranger, we just like to know that it's actually them. He's into music, Black Lives Matter, dancing, cooking, mental health awareness. Oh, he likes the Jonas Brothers. I like the Jonas Brothers. Okay. See, this girl is vibing with him. I'm telling you, that is a good profile. It's like, not only that, but the things that he added makes him at least seem like a good person, potentially. You know what I mean? Let's see, Ricky. Okay, that's a conversation starter. Software engineer at Google. The best way to ask me out is by saying, I like you, you're cute, let's go on a date. That's cute. Oh, these are good pictures. Okay. Ed. Let's debate this topic. Tommy McGuire is the best friend man. Agreed. Oh, a magic trick. That's cute. Okay, Mara, 26. Tattoo artist. I'm known for my ability to gaze into your... I hate that. I... <laughs> I'm known for my ability to gaze into your soul, bro. And the best part is the picture below it. <laughs> no shot. No shot. <sighs> my ability to gaze into your soul and the picture underneath i would just think please lose the ability to gaze into my soul i don't want to see it soul okay very deep okay the tinder one we might have to move them down yes oh my god up top this girl is goaded she fucking knows I prefer Bumble or Hinge. Tinder seems very hookup. It's 2021, I don't know. The profile doesn't really attract me. Okay, let's put Ed yep. here. Let's move him down. Uh, I'm rearranging everything. Good occupation, good pictures, and the video helps. For Ricky, I he's very positive. Good pictures. I don't agree with the first, but that's fine. Well. Each their own. Actually, you might have to put him down. His prompts are better. Yep. Yeah, I think Nick should be in the middle. He uses Tinder, but he just moved to Long Beach. So I can see why. For Maro. Uh, uh, she's kind of judging off of like the platform that you're using, that they're using too. Like whether it's Tinder or whatever. I think the my ability to gaze into your soul is a little too deep for me. We're just on a dating app. Yeah, okay, I'm set. The honestly, these last two are equivalent or like, I don't even care to rank them. They're just both bad. And the rest, I mean, I also don't. This number two, eh. It's, it's interesting because I just feel like the ones that are very normal, just, they're not even that uh, crazy in terms of anything, but they just like, just at least they're normal. They seem like normal people and the rest, So I put Ricky first, Ed second, Nick third, Maro fourth, and Being Tyler. normal is special on dating profiles. That is literally how I feel right now. I feel like, wow, like, how is normal like the... Tyler laughs. I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry. His face. Wait, I need to see his face. Nick third. Maro fourth and Tyler last. Grocery got <laughs> humbled. I'm sorry. Okay. He put himself first, or like put himself like, or like they, they nah. I 
that's a big that's a the second one to last was okay until the gaze into your soul that turned into a true crime doc for Valkyrie ray to react to <laughs> big um, jump did you place yourself first uh i did i i i, I uh, yeah, did I you? I feel like no one was taking that first. And why did you think you deserved it? Spot. No offense, but you kind of come off as like fuck boy. See, that's that's the thing. Yeah, <laughs> I I uh I get that a lot actually. I think for me as a college student, that's Man, what, what girls are really from? into. That's why I match a lot. I think, but all those people really want. That's just not what I hear. I don't hear that a lot of girls in particular are into fuck boys. If anything, I see on TikTok or other things all the times that they don't like them. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. A fling or something. And I guess my only question would be, I know these two are using Hinge. I know you were using Bumble and I know you used Tinder. Does the app make a difference? It does. It depends what the girl's looking for. On my end, I don't think girls look for hookups. I mean, there are a few girls that might and I would think they gravitate towards Tinder. I'm just gonna delete Tinder after this now. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, I'm done with Tinder. I came- Well, it depends. If you're- if he's looking for hookups, then stay on Tinder, bro. I went to it thinking it was more of a- But if you want, really. Mm -hmm. But it, you can have good looks, but it doesn't mean you're hubby material. I, I think it really changed my perspective of how, you know, the, the dating app world is. That, that was a confidence booster for sure. I, think I, I mean, he just had, he just seemed like a nice guy. He had nice, like, wholesome things on his profile. Dating apps with the intention of being a bit more attention seeking rather than actually attempting to go on a date with somebody. And I think the biggest thing is we need to kind of abolish this idea of hookup culture and get back to just humans connecting with other That's humans. nice. That's nice. I, I mean, I hope he's humbled. He's just like, yeah, I get a lot of matches and stuff, or whatever. Okay. He does not like her. <laughs> <laughs> really yeah, I mean, he has to say has something i guess i think we should judge on repeat dates not matches true true Yeah, I... I don't know. I don't know if there's really something that... Uh... What if they judge by their Insta profile? Um... It depends, because sometimes... I don't know if you get, like, uh... Inst it depends how they caption things, if that's cringe or if it's a... Uh, I'm not sure. Um, I guess that's like on dating profiles or anything too. Well, cute might delete later captions. Um... Mm -hmm. play one Valorento game. I'm gonna go pee beforehand. Beer beat! Yeah.
I'm back. Oh, jump noises? Oh, it's probably, is it on, uh, Valorant? Alright. I'm gonna play one Valorant game, and then we'll call it. Yep, sorry. I'm gonna get a drink. Whenever I drop a can of coke or something, I'm scared that it's gonna fizz the frick out. Ruh -roh. Ba -ba -ba -ba. Yeah! Cause it's Mother's Day. Morpheus, thank you so much for the eight months. Welcome back. Thank you. Thank you, thank you. Burp, 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 burp. Okay, one Valorant game. We can win this, right? Soda cans exploding is a very moment. I remember back then people talk about, uh, um, I don't know why it was talked about more, just more of a for fun thing, but putting Mentos in sodas or whatever and then shaking it up. I guess more real life social experiment fun activity type of thing. Oh, they lucked in rain. They got smokes. Hmm. Play Viper or Probably Viper or Sage. Or I want to do that if the other person can pick. What they would like to play. Okay, then I will play Viper. No one can hold a bad breath forever. Me Viper. Um, headset is better because I could actually feel like I hear more. It's like a more. Um, I could use my headset right now and then. But yeah, maybe I will. One sec, I'll change to my headset. That's it. Direction. <sighs> oh my goodness. Say it again, say it again. I didn't hear you. She said, Mabu, I like purple. So I blew her back out and I left her on red. Oh, okay. I didn't hear that. That shit bars, bars, bars. Bars, bro, bars. I like this too because, um. Two fives don't equal a ten. Quick math, never say it again. It's, it's just so easy for me to put on. Wireless. I love that it's wireless. Easy peasy. As long as I don't even restart my game, I might have to go back to my earbuds if, uh, if I didn't, re I need to restart my Valorant. I didn't make the switch beforehand. Perfect. Why does it feel like it's taking so long to load in? One Happy Meal is $16? Bro, what happened? What the hell happened there? Hi, Yuna. What up? Uh, I'm thinking if we go A, I can block off, maybe, yeah, yeah. We can plant and I'll block it off or some shit. Uh-oh. I mean, A. We have to go A. Here. Oh, never mind. Okay, I can hear. 
I just had to turn up the volume on my headset. Can you guys hear fine? You okay. I don't know what Mojo said. Oh shit, I don't want the shorty. Where the fuck did the chamber go? Hmm. Rotate! Alright. Fuck, as soon as I put down my wall. Chamber's here, watch, watch, watch. Chamber's here. On my mark. Fucking lot. Still shooting there. Nice. 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 <gasps> Holy shit. Last one's here. Not here, not here. He's definitely flanking. He's flanking, flanking. This guy talks a lot. He's 100% like flanking. There's no, he's not. Okay. Oh. Yeah. Oh, I dinked him. Me too. Nice. Oh, wait. Oh. Vayner's still hungry? I'm sure my pets can chase out some game for ya. Hehehe. Nice soup. Oh, yeah. Good job, guy. Any turn this It's okay. Guy. Um, I got your both one. Yeah. If I go out, would ya? Let's go, Viper. Oh my god, the vandal. This shit fire though, this is good. Hmm. That looks nice. Oh my god. Oh, that's rough. Yes, that is rough. Oh my god! Oh my god! Platform. Oh Jesus shit. Christ. No, 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 Honestly, I thought it was third round. <laughs> I'm just fucking shit. Don't sit down. We're not done yet. Uh, this is fucking funny, bro. I'm <laughs> um, just for up here. Buy, buy heavy, buy heavy. Uh. And. I'm gonna challenge the guy Bass and just kill him, and then you guys can push up on the side. Balding and balding. Have raised him. And don't give him bomb. Holy shit! He triple dinked me with the specter and still lost. Nice. All right, let's go, guy. You don't have smokes? What the fuck? What the fuck? 52 three times to the head, I don't know how he's not dead. <laughs> what is this, bro? <laughs> oh, oh my god. Oh my god, what the fuck? You have bomb punch. Ow. Ow. Holy. Oh my god, we have bomb punch. Uh oh. Uh, oh, let's get our gun. Sorry, bad wall. I don't know. Move as a unit, okay? Last thing I need is some hero 
Oh, yeah, I'll buy, bro. <laughs> Wait, who had that Deagle? Oh, who had the Deagle? That, that pretty Deagle. Does anyone have a good Deagle skate? Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah. Yes. Listen, 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 listen. There's gonna be um, a guy who's gonna come out here in like three seconds. Thanks. Is there? I'm waiting for the guy that's gonna come out here. Well, he would have if there wasn't noise. Right, 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 right. One's deep long now, so careful garden and careful flight. Chamber trip under. Flash and go. Oh. Garden. Garden with sure. off. I, I see that! <laughs> then go! Let me. Miss you. Last player standing. Yo, W plan, holy shit. Oh my oh, god. <laughs> hey, bro, that's not my fault. Nice shirt. I mean, I did come guarded. I said clear guarded. So, it's not my fault. I come. Nobody said it was his fault. I hate him. Oh, uh, that wall was kind of shit. It funneled us into one spot, and they could have just like jumped over it, and then we had to look up, and we had to look like up and down. I think that's perfect. Yeah, well, we had to look vertical. It's still so that wall's kind of shit. Yeah, but we could also done that with a wall that we didn't have. You know what I mean? Yeah, I remember. I don't know why I bought an off. I was just gonna challenge this guy, but he's not here. Oh, those are up. Holy shit! Oh my god. If you get the. If, oh, never mind. You got the back Yeah. Someone's <laughs> gotta. Oh my goodness. Bro, right. what is this game? May I have your deagle again, please, Scott? Got Scott, yours. I... Can I have your deagle, please? <laughs> I got more. Thank you. Uh, and five for next. Five for next. Chamber pushes up B, Hookah. You were right. I kind of just like. Eh. Why? Uh, the sage just scares right. me. I should running in with the bomb, bro. Can you like, cool, like quiet down? Can you like talk more? Who? Oh yeah. Oh uh, god. Thank you, Chamber. Damn! Enemy that wall is shit, bro. What Man. is this? I hate this guy. It's planted for nothing. Spike yeah, you walled off your teammates too. One enemy remaining. Oh my god. Uh, she's right, cubby. Yeah. Thank God. The sage is so oh, yeah. I mean, bad. I, I, I already told you why that was bad, right? Like, under that, especially if we had sight. Why doesn't she just wall? Can you just wall CT or uh, elbow? Yes, please. And by, uh, uh, I don't fucking know. Can you just like cut heaven off somehow? 
like do like a orb lineup or some shit, bro. You got that right. Mm, no, but I can try another way. You want to oh, oh, I know, I know. Play. You could go from here and you could do that thing. Enemy oh, yo, wait, I'm not, I don't really want to do this. Yo, like, oh, what are you saying, there. man? Like, I'm confused. Going? Oh, we're that not enemy race? That's crazy. Yeah, that was our race. Our race kind of threw that, you know? That's why I did no, what? Where the fuck? No. Mr. Rexter, thank you so much for the prime. It, it was a joke, dude. It was a joke. Yeah, just run down the What was he looking at? That's great. Is this coming to me, bro? I nice try. My Mercury, thank you so much for the seven months. Welcome back. Thank you. Yeah, he doesn't have it. He doesn't have it. I agree. He's like saying shit, but. Pushing B is Viper's kind of annoying. So I think we go A. Uh, Viper, can you go here? And then put your wall straight, like. From here. Yep, I can. Fuck it, I have to buy something. Someone picks baths, I think we just get them too. Yeah, Let's just all- I can aid bath. Needing back. Okay, you got that guy. You don't- you don't lose that. Okay, go, go, go. This I'm gonna ult, wait. Uh, no. We're waiting, we're waiting. I don't know why you still have your nice- Okay, wall's dropping. Alright, we TP! Yeah, then go with them. Go, go the fire! Go, go! There's one flank, bro. Oh my gosh. Watch out, Viper. Chamber sleeper! Oh! I died. What is this wall, bro? Hey, oh! Last player standing. And the Viper ult? Oh, W. <laughs> yeah, I don't know about ulting. Oh, bro, I'm not. I... No. Why would you? That's a 1v5 with the marsh. Nice yeah, but they would all be 1 HP, bro. 1 HP. Yeah, with the marshal. <laughs> you can kill him with a pistol if they're 1 HP. Yeah. Oh, I'm tired of this guy! So <laughs> crazy. You don't believe me? I don't believe No, I really don't. Flipper, no. did you believe in yourself? No, no shot. Exactly. You gotta believe in yourself, dog. Come on. <laughs> I need you to do better walls, bro. Hey, Fuck shut your up. walls. I, don't play I play Arena, bro. He is the one. Okay, that's I fine. Did, no, I did. did you lose your common sense with that? What? What, bro? Ah! <laughs> Damn. No, I'm gonna challenge. Me, I wouldn't take that. I'm gonna challenge Bath. What did you say? <laughs> he said he wouldn't take that. Some shit like that. Dude, have you second. not seen like okay. yeah you uh, play uh, Reyna bro do you not see how other I people fucking second, wall in the game like did you lose did you lose that, that was not <laughs> how do you, you ever see how other Hello. people do Hello. shit i'm lagging yo w bait holy shit what the fuck i'm just gonna zap every guy One is you haul. One is you haul. Still you haul. Yeah. Don't let me die. Don't let me die. Don't let me die. Viper, please. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Chill, bro. Reloading. I hate these. Reloading. One's probably gonna come through either CT or whatever. I got 18 seconds. Left. There's one on. Hey, you got double mo. Yo, 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 Oh, you got it. Close. You got that bitch. Yeah, Molly. Yeah. Nice. Yeah. Nice. Yeah. And that's yes. how we clutch up. Do it yourself. These guys are. Yo, where's the guy again, dog? Hey, fuck you, bitch. I got my two. Need a drop. Thank you. Can you buy me? Thank you. Shit it. I hate it here, man. This game 
name is Dog Diggity Doo Doo. Surfer is wild. Five, six. You had to count to get that three. <laughs> Wait, what? Jamie plays here. You have dyslexia, so you can't count. Is it? Trips over here. I don't want to really push this. You can rotate. We oh. flash it. No, 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 no. Should rotate. Please don't jump out. Please don't. Oh god. I think oh, we should rotate. Okay. Shit. How the fuck did you stay alive? <laughs> oh my god. The trip was gone because the chamber died. Oh. That's... Yeah, we should have pushed yeah. that. Yeah. I fucking hate you. Oh. Yo, he. Okay, so. I Why oh, I fucking pushed it, but like, is this like wrong? Oh, oh 40 on the brim. This is the most, like, I've ever expressed in comms because I am so, like, these guys are crazy. They make me feel like yeah, I could be crazy. So, you know, I'm gonna be crazy because we're all being loud here. Oh my god! My bad. Hey, hey, get the off, get the off, get the off, get the off, get the off. You hold, you hold, you hold. I feel like I'm just absorbing you some can't just of the like, like, not tell him where. I said straight to the right. I gave him the exact command. Straight to the right. Straight. <laughs> Can I get the bob back? Whoa, my god. Damn, you're not even gonna buy him? That's so. Can I get a drop? Damn. If you want this, take it. This is different, bro. This is different. I don't even you found the four enough. guys born with the Valorant exactly. accents? I think I did. I'm gonna challenge the fucker a lot. Jet always peaks bats. If someone's to kill him, they can. It's kinda shit. You guys can push up, I'm holding. Oh my god. One's 14 on the raise, out of showers. But that stage won't be on. Bad. I'm gonna jump up and just go for the space. Yeah. Fuck. I fucking hate your walls. Bro. Oh my god! Hey, get me no, no, no! Oh. I'm leaving the fuck out of here. What the fuck? No, 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 go, go, go! I can't. Uh. Alright. You got me stuck in the wall now, dog. What the fuck? Fuck you, I got two of them. Yeah. I got three of them. This sage is something oh. else! Oh. else. Yo, I've never, I don't think I've ever reported someone for being bad before, but I want to report him for being bad. Can I do that? Hey, I'm gonna write in the description. Just... No, he's only play. that he sings. He's playing. Yeah, on my way. Oh my gosh. 80, 80, 80. 80 and then uh, main. Oh. oh yeah! Hey, 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 wow, you're so good. Oh my god. Where's my ace bro? Where's my ace? Um, I already took it. Your fault. Should have gotten the kill. What? <laughs> All good, bro. Combat stage. Combat stage, my ass, bro. You jumped on top of him. Shut the fuck up, bro. That was a god you stuck point, in, bro. You got stuck in a corner. That was like, I killed two of them, bro. God play. Yeah, because they were being stupid. <laughs> I stuck them. Stuck in a lobby of boy boys. I'll get one tap, bro. Oh, just cut. I'm not a peeker, bro. I'm a Jinx, why would you disconnect, bro? Bro's just mad, bro. Ah, what a lard. Two coming. Oh, I died. Hey, hey, get my There. Player standing. Goes on the fucking wall. Oh, 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 oh,
there. Good cello, thank you so much for the two subbies. Thank you. Switching My actual just men. Hey, Raina, you back, bro? What happened, dude? You're still going. DC again. This is how I imagine the fuck boy from dating profiles before it plays Valo. Yeah, I know. Why? Uh, I'm, I don't know why I'm up here. Stop them. It is lame. It is lame. They're coming, they're coming, they're coming, they're coming. Enemy spotted. Hey, hey, hey. Alright, I'm out of here. There's Here's something coming. Oh, he had a jam. Ah, fuck. Is it planted? Headshot. Where did arena go, bro? Oh my god, he one tapped me, bro. Okay, you got this. Yeah, that's a cool pretty skin. One enemy remaining. Get his debut. Satchel out. Satchel out. Yo. <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck is this? I'm getting dizzy. What is happening, man? What is happening? This is just so cringe. So weird. I don't get it. I don't get it. Get me out. So weird, why? Wall again, eh? Oh, one shower. No, I got one tap, bro. Cambridge. Oh god. Okay. Oh my god. He just looked at me. Ooh. Yes. <laughs> what is this? Is this game? Oh, but I was just asking where uh, Reyna was. Oh. oh my god. Hey. 141 on the raise, bro. Hobby. Mm hmm Oh, 
Oh. He was right there. What the fuck? I didn't even see Nice shot. Oh, oh that effort. Do we lose less if we have a DC? I would like to know. Damn it. I don't think so, but why not? Riot, don't you feel any empathy for us? You get extra money for missing a player? Yeah, but what about... What about the RR? Oh no, it's all good. <laughs> I was saying no RR to like riot type of thing. But it's you guys. Last uh. player standing. Oh? Spike planted. Mm, well, what do? What don't diggity do? What do we do? Rocket Potato, thank you so much for the five months. Welcome back. Only way to get reduced R is having good stats in the game? Yeah. Isn't that kinda hard? Oh, exclamation mark crosshair. gonna leave it at that we just uh somebody get the last loss oh damn i can do it i can do it you want to play let's play the two hours easy peasy Oh, because me and Myung have this thing where we try to stream as like more than each other. Let's see if we whoever does. Spike planted. For fun. Yeah. Not stakes, just like um Whoa. Bro. Thank you. I don't know if we should, uh... Oh my god. Why? Hey, well. Attackers win. I'm a giddy. Accuracy. And what a lame game. Had to deal with them and they DC'd and we lost. Cursed. It was so whack. Yeah, it was whack vibes. Oh, big, big game. Okay, all right. I gotta go now. <gasps> but I got the cute banner. That's a plus. Okay, I'm happy now. All right. Uh. All right, guys, I gotta go. Thank you guys for watching. I'm gonna have to call my mom at some point. Too. Oops. Okay. Uh, thanks for watching. I will see you guys tomorrow. Um, I think we're gonna be playing some games with Saikuno, but I don't know what we're doing yet. Maybe Fortnite, maybe Valorant type of thing. 
Yeah. I will 